Take it slow, let it go, roll down all the windows.
Welcome, everybody, to another night of VDC action. Tonight, we're bringing to you Master Grand Finals. I'm your producer, Nuclear Cats. In the booth, we have the lovely Stab to Death and Xiao. Lads, are y'all ready for some wonderful game? Uh, for some wonderful games. When am um, I not ready, man? <laughs> I indeed am ready. I just hope it doesn't go the distance. Oh, I'm hoping it goes the distance. We want the five game bangers here. Triple OT, love it. Hey, the players might have taken their G Fuel suit, but I have not. Had man, to shoot that in, bro. Had to shoot in their life. Well, but yeah, PA versus KC. Um, I agree with Tony in the chat, by the way. Haven't we already seen this game? Then P already yeah. won this game. Okay, deja vu. Are we having a rematch or? Yeah, is this a rematch or what's going on? Oh, do you have the right team thought? Well, do, uh, yeah, is this the right to team? To make sure the beat lads on? at home, because there's probably someone who's not unaware with the operations. Maybe your family's watching, they need a refresher. Last week we had Elite Grand Finals. We have multiple tiers in VDC and Elite Tier. We happen to also have Party Animals and Kingdom Coffee as our Grand Finalists. But in Master, we see the same franchises, but different teams uh, to bring in a di different tier competition. So it's 10 players in their own Grand Final for a different tier competition. It's going to be wonderful. We'll get started with our map bands momentarily. Um, any, any predictions for the map bands, y'all? Any predictions for the map bands? Well, I won't be too surprised by a scent ban from PA. I know they don't particularly enjoy that map, but literally, I think everything's on the table for these teams. They can basically play anything. I mean, it is a five-map series, so you have to see who is the better team. I mean, you're just going to ban two maps. So that is true. Whoever, whoever is picking the first map will have to pick two of their favorite maps so that they can close it out in three, if they want to, that is. I mean, maybe they want the banger as well. Who doesn't love banger games? I don't. <laughs> what do you mean, don't? How do you not love? It's 2 a.m. You're sweating in your gamer chair. And you just... Game 5 of the Grand Finals. It's triple OT. And you whiff your shots and lose. Who doesn't love those moments? Yeah, I mean... I won't. If I whiff those shots, I won't. <laughs> <laughs> but imagine how happy you're making the other team, though. Yeah, I prioritize being happy before spreading happiness. I mean, yeah. yeah I mean, I think like, something like to be in my booth. I have to carry all. I have two computers open. Like I'm in an <laughs> oven. Once I'm leaving it to the boys to cast, I'm going to mute my mic and turn on the fan to not burn myself up because. I'm trying. I'm cooking. Yeah. I'm cooking. Not some G Fuel soup, but I'm cooking in here, and he's cooking something. Cook I've been cooking, yeah. Um, just waiting on these map bands. Like I've got it queued up, and I the told them the map band, the but players are also... they're taking a bit. Well, we hope the ma we hope the teams in the lobbies are also cooking something because this is grand finals. Whoever wins will be crowned champions for season four. Masters Valorant Draft Circuit. The most pre 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 I can't speak. Prestigious of awards being a champion of VDC. Not many can say they are. Yay? No VDC champions. <laughs> well, FNS? I don't see a trophy in his hands. <laughs> but Aspas these guys, one world. of these teams, are going to leave with a VDC trophy. Yeah, we can only call Aspas the greatest off, in the world once he gets his Valorant Draft Circuit trophy, right? Isn't that why he's coming to NRG, you think? To lower his ping when he exactly. competes on the weekends in VDC. Wherever Aspas is going, he won't be getting a VDC trophy there. But we are in map bands and selects. And bind off the table for KC. Any thoughts about that? I, I feel like bind well, when we re, when we reintroduce it into the pool. I feel like every team picked bind, um, so I, I think it is a bit of a weird pick to to end that outright. Um, but also, fuck bind. Bind is a bad map. But every team picked bind except for KC, who does not have a single game on it. So perma band, maybe they hate it as well. They agree with you. 
But we're waiting here for PA's first ban. No, I had just Won't realized. Won't be surprised that. from a Haven being here. I just realized that I had forgot to even send it. I to PA. I, yeah, I, I forgot to send it to PA. So I just sent it now. Well, yeah, that's everyone in chat, you know, well, chat, oh, everyone in here's, chat. here's you know coming. What, what it's already is. coming. We know what Teddy's about to say. <laughs> we know what Stab's about Hashtag to say. Hashtag blame Prod. <laughs> It is hashtag blame prod, guys. It's another hashtag blame prod night. Exactly. How, it's grand finals, new. How could you not send the map bans to both teams? Man, chill, chill. We are utterly disappointed, and hence we. The only way to repent for this is for you to do a maid stream. Shut up! Where Shut is up! the maid stream? <laughs> But Lotus Bam coming coming. Give me a paycheck sure. and I'll do that, yeah? Not like one okay. cent. <laughs> a paycheck? Okay, any donos in chat then? Oh uh, no, I don't have donos enabled. <laughs> we'll take some. Uh uh, that's sad. But anyway, Here, I'll just I'll just tell you all tell you all my social security number and then y'all can just like buy a car and then mail it to my house, right? That that'll be the payment. Oh yeah. Oh uh, yeah, I could definitely, I definitely have the funds to buy a car. I'm 18, man. Whatever. They finally, Ooh, anxiety was they finally gotten around. Anxiety to banning here. the second map. EA decided to get rid of Lotus. No, they don't like the three site maps, even though we're gonna see a three site map guaranteed with Haven. So, shot off the cards, but we'll see that if they true. try to save that to the last map. But hey, we'll see. But Lotus is a strong map for KC. Three and O on that. But I am surprised they then ban Haven, which KC is six and one on, which I argue is a stronger map record than the three and Thoughts? Maybe uh, PA have a uh, game plan going into the into the map bans. There, maybe they're cooking they're up thinking, something. Yep, maybe they're cooking up something on Haven. Maybe they have a strategy. There I go. Or maybe there they I believe go. that their their Haven is better. Yep, speaking of Haven, Casey's first pick makes sense. Six and one. I cursed it, Dan. It's the three it's the three site maps, so that's what you said. No, I said that PA hate guaranteed well, to have PA one. didn't have a chance to counter that. They didn't like three site maps. It's not like they can ban it again. Uh because it's five map. Gotta go get all of them. No no I don't know. It is interesting yeah. to see that PA didn't go for the Pearl ban. Because that has been their permaban throughout the season. Actually, you, you gave us a bunch of the advanced scrim leaks. I'm giving you the master scrim leaks since I'm in that league. PA has been actually scrimming on Pearl quite a bit, trying to test out. So they at least practiced on the map despite not having any official games on it. Oh. But Ascent is the pick here. Uh... They do have a quite experience on Ascent. Nine games played. The most, I think, on one map of any team. Despite not having the greatest record, four and five, it is definitely a comfort for them. Interesting. So so PA have been cooking, you would say, on Pearl. They have been cooking. It's a I tell you, pick. That there is a specific agent that they were cooking with, but I don't know if it's coming out today. Oh, I'm guessing it's a Euro pick. <laughs> a, a Euro a pro pick. Hmm. Hmm. But they were, they were, they were cooking. It also depends on the player that was playing that special agent because today both teams have a sub subbing it for them. That is correct. Teki out on PA side and Tresente in. And on the side of KC, I believe it's Monkey out with Saintistic in. So this grand finals, both sides having a sub. That's that's one of the tests that they have to really endure through, having seeing if they could play a full five game series of a completely new player on their team. So we'll have to. See, I mean, we don't know if they're going to be a if, if that sub is going to be playing all the maps, or they're subbing out just for a specific map, buying time until their main player comes back. But that Always is true. Possible. But whichever team wins, that sub will be getting a special role in the disc for. Playing on the victory. championship team, yep. Wait, I should be subbing. Wait, someone <laughs> dropped me inside me. <laughs> but Casey does ban pick split. 
And Make that leaves. Yep. That leaves Fracture and I believe Pearl's last. Fracture, Fracture and Pearl. Pearl. Yes. Of course, they have to leave the best maps for last or not even leaving them at all if we see a 3 0 for one. I'm a, I'm a Fracture. And man, I, I feel like a lot of people give you hate for calling Pearl one of the best maps. I don't know, man. Fracture, that that, one, that, that half was sarcastic, story. but Fracture. I'm a fracture enjoyer. Fracture. No. Well, I'm a fracture enjoyer, man. I'm a fracture enjoyer. Well, we have the. I, I absolutely despise fracture. We have the sides coming in. What do you think about fracture? The fourth? Right, fracture is fourth. The fourth side of maps. So if, if one of these maps. If, if we are left with. No. What am I going to say? We see four maps. We're going to see fracture, and I will be thoroughly happy. But. Uh, Fracture is a fun map for me because I pick Neon and I just farm the orb. But that is true. Or you can do the King King strat, getting knives second round, getting all four orbs on the map both rounds. I pick Raze. But Raze, get... sides haven't picked is defense across the board. It's so leaving far, me with more yes. work, so I have to so far, the overlay yes. every time. <laughs> I'm gonna switch the sides, switch the players. But... It's like. <laughs> but perfect. both teams doing love that. sitting back and doing nothing. That is perfect, giving more work to our producer. Exactly. Uh... Well, more chances for us to blame prod. Hashtag blame prod. Hashtag blame, uh, more hashtag blame prods in the chat, man. It's not like we get enough, but another defense pick on uh, the KC on Fracture. Yeah, I believe KC, the higher seed here, mm -hmm. will decide what side they're on, and they're going on attack with PA going on defense. Yep, so it's alternated for every map. That That's cool. <laughs> okay, oh. yeah. So PA also picking defense across three maps with KC picking defense on there too. It seems like these teams both like defense, so... Then I'll focus on the attack side. What do teams need to do on the attack side to show a strong start? Because clearly both teams prefer the defense side, at least. Well, I would say when you're playing uh, in a controlled environment, as in five people that you know together, defense would be the side to go because you can play well together. And I would say that each map, like every map has a better defensive side. Give or take a few maps, but you're better off starting on defense because you can you can use those few rounds to just warm up because the attack has to come to you. So you can lay back a little bit, calm yourself down, get get all warmed up, and then at switch of the half, that's when you begin firing on all cylinders. That is true, but if you start that defense side weak and you just get ran over by the attackers. I feel like it's hard to gain hope back when you're switching sides after getting run through. But while on attack, you always got the hope that's like, we got defense half next half. That's our stronger half. So what are your thoughts on that? Like, do you pick your stronger half first or second? We pick our stronger half first, uh, spe uh, specifically our team, because uh, we like to start hot. And we know that when we're in the lead, there's a chance that we throw away the lead. So, oh. <laughs> side is attack. So you go for those few as many as we can get, and then afterwards, we play our best on defense. All right, we're about to get. Oh no, I shouldn't be leaking shots because always is watching. We're about to get started with agent select, so I'm gonna leave it to your lovely casters, Stad and Shao. Take it away. Thank you, Duke. And here we are, gonna go into the first agent select of the first map for grand finals. We're on Haven. With PA being on defense, KC on attack. And nothing out of ordinary so far, I'll say, as a Yoru is being hovered. <laughs> but I doubt that's going to stay that way. Yeah, and they're just trolling us. I mean, we're trolling. used to it. We're, we're used to this now. I mean, the last game I casted with you, I saw like five Yoru's being hovered. That's a troll. Man, no one's one, of these one of these days, it won't be a bait, though. 
What are these days? Right? Well, that day is Saturday. <laughs> that, that day, day is Saturday. Saturday. That is true. I, did, I, did, yeah, I heard you guys are cooking something up. I don't know where you heard that. Completely false information. Anyways, let's move on to the end. Correct. Well, if we ignore the Euro pick and substitute that with a chat pick, it's almost similar because we have we have the. Well, actually, we don't see. Solos. Is that the first mm. deadlock we have seen at VDC? That's like the tenth deadlock. Is it actually? <laughs> I'm yes. out of loop then. A couple of teams have played deadlock, Choose especially right after. Deadlock was released to be allowed to play. Okay. Well, is that the first deadlock in Grand Final? It will not be a deadlock, it'll be a jet. But that's great. Both teams basically mirroring the one character different is the Silva for the Sky. I personally do like Silva more on this map. Any thoughts on the picks stabbed? I, I also prefer the solo comp. Uh it just provides more info that you can have. Although with the fate with the um I was going to say the player's name. Uh, with the Sky and the Breach, you do have additional flash util. Uh, but with the Sova, you also have the Shark Darts. You also have the info. You have the drone to get info. And who can forget the post plan ultimate that you can use. Hunter Fury that you can use to basically just clutch up a few rounds. Hunter Fury can clutch up a few rounds all on its own when you play post plan with it. Oh, 100%. But while I'm looking from the Sky pick, two key characters is the additional flashes. How will he enable... Rav to like be more aggressive, dash in, or even maybe statistic to TP again with those sky flashes. And plus, the sky heal, I, I feel like that's so underrated. No one like ever thinks about sky's heal when thinking about that agent, but on PA side, there is no heal, so all chip damage done and early starts that are around will stick throughout the whole round. And maybe that's another influence for the sky pick, which, not gonna lie, I'm actually, I don't hate that much. You don't need heal if each and every shot of yours lands on the headshot and you have better reaction time, right? That is true. Just hit heads. <laughs> the age law moniker. Exactly. I mean, if you hit a headshot before they even look at you, you have no damage taken. Hence, no heal needed. But Just be good. Here's the first pistols of Grand Finals. Masters Grand Finals, I should say. And... All of KC leaning towards this A side with PA kind of actually following with 3D and 2A. Look at PA, no one no one on the C side heavily pressured to us at right side of the map. Placing alarm like Rob, some contact play up with the arrow. Already broken the stun with a peak coming from Solar, but not finding anything other than probably a bit of trip damage, which Oh, so it takes the Finds the first one on Snowy up long. They spam through the smoke. As PA is all yeah, rotating over here. to this A site, and Casey's getting the hell out. You can see Solitaka reacting to that no longer aggression from Casey to its A site, and hence understanding that they might be pushing C. That's why the, you see that Omen smoke coming out as well. But Ralph put dashing onto site. Destroyed. Her broken. Now Ooh, they should have what to What a balance by Shiro. But it will be a 4v4 post plant for KC here. Planted for long. And all of PA slowly enclosing on these oh, two members the on site. Oh, the high low. The high -low. Uh, Ooh, insane. clean shots coming out of Rav. Already looking good out of there. This could Sal be Taco, she's walking out uh, with the fight and a peek out of Statistic. You get just up to Shiro and he does not find anything. It'll be the first round for KC. Good, Clean round. Um, yeah. I was saying, clean out of KC. They got the early Pugay and then they KC felt more pressure from the rotates. They felt the breach stun, the jet peeking short, and they just went C and no one was home. That's uh, it. Hey. Yeah, and great post points as well. Having a high low, having, having two players playing high low towards flank, and yeah. the players on site to take care of uh, garage, KD, yeah. the garage and CT. But look at here, Rob with the judge, ready to dash in at a moment's notice. Not finding anything garage, but. Um. 
Three just the missing each other. Three members of PA in this garage window area. And not finding anything as Fable gets three. It's all up to these two A main players pushed out. Looking for the flank, but... I would surmise if they find anything here. Spike planted. Well, Taco did get one before being killed by Fable. So that is indeed a gun down. They do have one gun down. Which is in Solar's hands, but it's four for Fable, and there's an ace coming out of him as well. That's gotta be a confident booster right there. Get your ecos, Fable. Get your ecos. Get your ecos, man. Oh, you know how we're talking about preferring the Silva pick? Fable's like, making us look stupid. This guy's getting value already. I don't know, I still prefer the Silva pick. Overall, I just think it's more balanced than team. That is true, that is true. But one thing to note, Fable, with that ace, getting five orbs, getting a plant down as well, six out of seven on his ult. And now passing so. on that phantom over to Rav. In first contact. And grabbing the orb, seeking it online. But something you should hear, look at PA sub every round. This heavy A lean with like, almost three players on site with 2B, then KJ Lake on C. How do you, do you like it? I'm not sure. I love it because I feel Casey will read it soon. Putting more pressure C and no longer. And that's something we saw yeah. in the first round as well. They got a pick on the A side and instantly rotated back to C because they would know because they heard all the rockets coming in from the side of PA. Yeah, but it will be the A hit here. Our solo is taking first contact. The judge coming out, so does the Dawn. As Rob trades one for one, but Solar gets two. Oh, that's the oh three for Solar? And one for Tristante as well. And it's all up to Mempire, Solo on the site. Somehow brings it down to a 1v2, it's so winnable for him. With the Bulldog here. But he has to get through Shiro and Sautako first. 30 seconds left. Like nowhere in reach. Probably trying to see if there's a flank. I'm not sure he has the bot up. He should know. Just repositioning. But 14 seconds on the clock. It's got. Oh, we'll get spiked, but I think. 10 seconds. Sure, we'll, we'll see find that. Much more. But, yep. Shero cleans it up. And that's first round for PA. But that's a good round. If you're a KC, that's a great round for you because you got three guns off of PA's hands while it's your bonus. Exactly. And look at the buys coming out of PA. It's probably gonna be a Jet Knives from Solar and a Marshall from Snowy. Not great guns, it should be. Should Oh, Guardian coming out. Opting for using the Jet Knives next round. Or I would have liked to see the buy being given to someone, some other teammate and uh, popping up Jet Knives. That oh. is true. Maybe a Guardian full shield for Tresente, but five rifles for KC. And this is what I was talking about. No one home on a C site. Casey putting some pressure down. Placing swarm grenade. And they just might find no one home here. I think the strategy for PA is to just play retake take on C. Uh, seems to be. Okay. So far, but, hasn't been that active them. So hasn't been that way for them. Because you're ready to flash them. Yeah. Solar, Maybe. slightly late to the rotate, but early pick from Rob on the Shisente, but she rotates them out. And he gets it. two here, getting paid, but Rob, the solo man on sight, is trying to fight everybody. And he's winning on his fights too. And look at One enemy the fire in the ass. Easy lurk. Great KJ lurk right there. Well, I mean, remember, your weapon solid, is only a tool. solid round. Just I really dislike how PA is playing the defense, having no one see, and well, I think KC is reading you? that quite well. They have the early A pressure, drawing out some rotates away from C, and is rotating off and hitting C. And it's been so well for them. You know, and I want to push something up. Yeah, normally stationing KJ towards C slash garage area is is a good call, but it seems like they're just leaving it completely open. The alarm bars, I think, holding out B main push, and no one's playing on C side. But now you can see KJ playing. So I'll have putting true. up a bit more heavier C setup than usual. But that leads to A site. Slightly more vulnerable. 
with buffs, jet, and silver here. Oh. And 320 games. Retro gonna be able to attack both, and that's another free snipe for KC and PA being forced to play retake. They do get away from size already again to play retake for the fourth time this time. I'm not expecting too much out of them here. This is their save, but Solar with these jet knives is scary. As there comes the Silver Dara. Recon. I'm sorry to recon. They're coming out. That's the first pick already for Sal Taco. She finds one. Solar finds ones as well. But KC's trading back equally as well. But St. Distant looking for more. Both PA members low. But it is a 3v2. Time is ticking on a bomb. It seems like they're just choosing to die to spike. Nothing yeah. they can do here. I mean, they got their two frags. They got their two. Tried. Yep. Grabbed nope. a gun. Let's not talk about live here. I don't think nope. so, yeah. We're not able to save the gun. But it was their save. They got two guns. Not the worst thing in the world, but the score line is starting to become concerning. 4 1, five rounds in. Well, I think I would say this is the first round where they're all gonna have guns. And it'll be a fair fight because everyone's gonna have complete Uto. Looks like 320 games does not want to buy shield. Is that a new strat? I mean, did we not see that event? Grand finals? No shield strat? And it works down to end? But well, he is gonna buy it to end. He is buying it. <laughs> and it's gonna be. Man, KC just keep finding these holes. No one mid right now. And two members of KC fully peeking this. Is that no a two? Today. Ooh, Solar. Oh, finding them for here. Games and Fable are aware of this. Solar. Do they know? They should. With they the do. counter priest on coming out. I think they saw the elbow or the shoulder of, J of Jet. It has a spray coming in. Look at yeah. this. Walking up towards C. Walking up towards C. They love doing this. Having that early A pressure with ending a C hit, but. Sal Taco is ready for this. But yeah. will she be ready for it? Maybe she games coming out of Garage as well. She might just have to give up sight here. She's getting pinched from both sides. The dash coming out, so does the- Oh, fully fine and getting that kill. And still it's like that fight. Solar it's gets two, Rav. by the way. We'll just all up to them. Rav and Saintistic here. Right there. But oh, oh no. That abstract is not gonna- Oh. Well, the paranoia should be. I see! 30 seconds left. But, it is still a 2v2 with dropping one shot. Snowy take him out. And would they know a solar is? No! Try to TP away and slowly cleans up the round. And what a crucial round for PA. A good flank by Slower as well to get two of the KC players who are rotating off from that B A pressure. Man, like, that's a tale of two. Saintistic with his two as well, backside, getting the Omen blind off and swing. And then Solar getting two. I believe it was in Garage. And it looked like that game, that round could have gone both ways. It, it surely was. I mean, I mean, Rav was, what, one or three HP, so it was close. Get out of my of way! Course. And now, more A pressure here with the same dart. Aftershock combo, or obviously aftershock tremor combo. But Solar trying to peek short here, taking some contact. Well, fine, oh, it's it. no And get out as well. Man, Solar loves the short angle. He keeps finding value from it. Yeah, no one's keeping track of it. I mean, they did for a few rounds, but then now they just forgot that Solar's not going to re-peek them? Uh, maybe they just expect them to have, like, just keep re-peeking short over and over again. But this cross long is dangerous and Fable will think different from pushing up. And look once again, they slowly move A and then they rotate C midway through the round after fighting a bit. Oh, and, but Memfire finds one on B. But South Taco, she might find a timing as well. Maybe not. Maybe find a timing on Memfire actually. Maybe Memfire's finding a timing on her. But. Yeah, Sigi is green. Oh, oh, well, it's a might be right. No, that's not a no. Does not. Oh, and Vampire gets the oh. free pick. So look at Solar. Raw, so far forward. Oh, this is Silver you're talking about. Vampire finds another one on Solar. He just 
being a thorn in your side. Remaining. With 320 games clear up to Sente. And man, what a clean round from KC once again. I feel like I keep saying this. Nice! Killed it! Oh. In them. Yeah, so there's no on C site. There was, there was an alarm bot for Garage and a turret on site. But no one playing on site, no one playing off of that util being used. Here. So it just seems like a waste of the util on site at the moment. That is true. I feel like the C site just bolts so well for like KC. Like every time they hit the site, there's no one on PA on the site, and the retakes have been so lackluster with Vampire being able to find two of you once there and just pretty much ending around. Right there, and once again, Sao Taco by herself on the site. And an eco round as well this time for PA, and that's the one dinosaur she had gone. Like, that's pretty much, that's KJ's whole kit, gone. But, look at Snowy, got your trail. gets cleared out of Empire, finds nothing of value. And the Seeker's coming out. Should be in Solar. Solar being window. They uh -oh. should know, but I doubt Solar find anything. And neither does Sal Taco. Round kind of falling apart for PA, which is to be expected. This is their eco. Look at how split up they are. Oh, uh -oh. <laughs> be putting, in some damage. A, a bit awkward there. But the sure, error yeah, is here, I need some damage. Get one. one down. Oh my Gets god. Down Nasty ass shots by Oh, Rav. I think Memper, did Memper see? Tresente? No. Spike planted. I don't think so. But I think Memper will find the skill in the end. Uh, at least that should give it for off. Yeah, and here is... Oh, Thunder knife kill? Yeah. Knife. Wow. This is what I was talking about, remember? In agent select or in map select, I was talking about if you start on a defense and you start getting ran o run over by the attackers, how do you come back from this? What if you're an attacking like... team? You could be an attacking team. That is true. They could be an attacking team. We don't know. Maybe they're, fa they're maybe they're the fans are choosing their weaker side first, so they have to, to bump up. But the game changer here. That's off from Solar. Let's see what value he does because. Four members are five members are funneling into this A side. An op can change the whole game. Can change but the whole side. We need to coming out, but Ooh, Ooh, shots not is, connecting from solar. And, as well. and it seems like he's just backing off into CT, playing the passive angle. It's like AJ oh coming out with nothing to be able to break that. No solo for the side of PA. Seems like they will have to evacuate, and it might be a fake coming out. Look at all of Casey's numbers. Look at the spike on C Long. She was aware. Sharo is here. This one v one with statistic is lost. So a free site for KC. And man, I'm getting deja vu here. <laughs> okay. Oh, South Taco will be running to the long bot. Spike planted. Look at South Taco, but also look at Rav. Rav. Oh yeah. Here coming out of A site just now, ready to the long flank. Well, two members of KC is ready for this flank from uh, Sao Taco. Sao Taco. Here comes but. the retake reach. Oh, oh my God, Timmy! <laughs> but oh, one enemy remaining. The flank. Oh, it's, it's all up to Rav here on the flank, and he is found. Standing. But he brings it down to one v one. Sao Taco, one try here, has to find her shots and will not find any. Rav clutches it out for yeah, okay, see. Yeah, KC. <laughs> the size against that op. But. I mean, that round. I mean, it was winnable. I mean, we thought South Africa would at least picked off by Taco. the two flanks, but. Taco yeah. Taco got the... both of them. Yeah, Taco finds both, but Rav on the other side flanking as well. And, and I feel like Casey just owns the site right now. The C site. Like, it's all theirs. Every time I see them on this site, I feel like they just can't lose. It's always a some sort of retake, which they've just been winning out every time. Yeah, they've just not been that aware. Of oh! oh! What a shot for Tresente. Getting a first blood for the PA side. And oh, Snowy would not find one, but Solar trades them out oh. equally, so 4v3. Oh. Make the, oh. Correct me. 3v3. Sure With a here. rifle on Solar's side and 
Same distant nose. Oh, he's a knower. Oh, it's oh, all up his solar. Okay, see, so, yep. Yeah. With the blade stone, Fable coming in. With the flash recognizes the solar's here, and well, oh, they all rotate. Look at Vampire though. Oh, okay, oh you know. here. no way, solar checks this, but does not decide to go window in the first place. Vampire has all the info though. There, that should also give more info. Oh, yep. and, and... get picked off in three, two, one. Yep. Oh, never check that and go in a million years. Vampire, what's these? Quite insane lyrics. I feel like he. Every time I look at the map, he's somewhere that the PA members just won't expect, and he's just getting multiple kills off of it. Yeah, if you look at the scoreboards, 13-4 from Empire. He's been putting in some work after that. And as if, I was gonna say, I think B has to call a timeout here, and which they do, by the way. But what should it turn out? do you feel like it's too late? Two rounds left in this half. Maybe they're trying to like claw these, get to an A4, and just think about next half I, at this point because man, this half is looking rough. I'm looking for a 9-3 half because the 9-3 curse is pretty deadly. That is true. Play. Oh, on a more serious note, he will be looking. I think the time out is to make sure that they don't even give up the remaining two rounds left in the half because it's it's hard to come back from a two ten half. Yeah, I feel like despite it only being a two round difference, a two ten half is like night and day versus a four half. A four half is definitely the oh, it's winnable stage like cope. It's a winnable, but two ten like you're you're starting to lose hope. You're starting to look at the next map and seeing what things you can change, but we'll see. This, this map's not done yet. I wouldn't yeah, this say map's not done yet. This map's not done yet. There is a full buy coming out of PA here. So it's definitely scary for KC. They need to play cleaning this round. Which they have been, but... Need to continue doing so as well. Yeah, they'll have to make sure not to lose any... They want it to be a flawless so that they... Because their eco isn't looking too good either. So if they lose this round... It's looking to be a 10 to half then, based on their next buy, so they'll want oh, to make this run count. And, man, look at Solar and Tresente already. Already up B main and early pop out the lockdown. Man, I'm surprised they're even planting here. They're all stuck on site, except for Rav in this backside position. All, all four players long. <laughs> I think Breach is the one that's retained at the moment. This is nice, oh, being more active fight. on the side with, uh... What a fight, but there's three more PA members here, but Solar is spawning two throughout the crowd, picking them. Like Dandelions, and it's just these two players stuck in the cubby. And then probably gets one. Remaining. Remember, sure. does find Fritz one. Shiro knows he's there and cleans him up in a much needed round for PA. That's three on the board for them. Oh, no, no, you don't deserve I mean, They're definitely going for that 9 3 half. That was yep. a discussion. I mean, Last round even if that, they the lose pitch. it. 9-3 curse. If they win it, it's 8-4. Nice. So, either way, I feel like... It's not bad for PA. I'm like, I'm fine with this half of Oslo. I mean, 8-4 half isn't too bad. You can come back. 8 four half. We're gonna have 8-4 half. But they yeah. need to win. Despite having 4 rounds in a row before that. 3 turning games. Needing a buy from a teammate, which... Luckily, they don't have money for that. But, looking at ults, they did invest the lockdown. And, I believe, a... Breach ult there. So those are two ults not available for this round was as Vampire gets a lockdown of his own. Yeah, but but uh, PA does have the Hunter's Fury. So he does have a Hunter, Hunter's Fury to counter that lockdown from the side of Vampire. That is true. With another standard hold from PA here with a two on A site. Both Jet. is not able to clear all of four. Oh. Look at this, this early peak way. from Solar. No support here, so... You should run! Any so info. Man. Stun coming out. Ooh, and not find anything. Not. Oh, finds the first one! Does not find a second, but the Hunter's Fury is coming out to... Clear out to Keijo, but... Just goes to too little, now. too late. Casey's already on site, but... Maybe a quick retake coming out of Solar oh, just sent Just peeking out, and They just get all four of Casey's members! It's four rounds for PA! It was a recon dot that I was talking about in retakes. That size. recon dot basically revealed three of their players' positions, due to which uh, PA's players were able to just get the get the info and just shoot them through the smokes. Yeah, like Jacinta there is just him by himself on side with Snowy Heaven. He he just runs out, starts shooting people. I mean, you have all the info with the silver recon, so why not, right? 
That is true. Like, what? They must have known that they're going to end A. It's like, I'm going to play Heaven, I'm going to shoot this recon when they start planting, and you just run out and kill them all. And what a game plan and what execution coming out of them. With Solar finding a pick of his own early, getting traded out, it doesn't matter because they're already ready. But, PA themselves looking to come on this A site, but KJ is set up here in contrast of what PA was doing on their defense half. Look at some tough Flink in their spawn. <laughs> Play, this, this, this is KJ life, man. As an avid KJ player myself, that's my life. But man, Solar's already in. Both fights come oh, going goodness. all PA's way. Solar finds two back sight. And another so one on Giraffe. So it's all up to Fable on the seaside itself. Orb it's collecting. Farming, orb farming, yep. But look at this, all taco. Oh. If we call the bot, so. Oh. But oh, the You're timing. Did she spot him? No, the Ujin uh, just missed. Maybe not. It, it looks like she knows though. But, Flawless. yep. Flawless yeah. round for PA. You know? Maybe that time bomb was just against, was to just disrupt the momentum of KC. Yeah, they, they, they've they been looking quite good these past three rounds. All going their way. From a, like, possible 10-2 half to now a 5-8 scoreline. Uh, you know, PA, they're happy with this. They're like, they got the momentum too. They're gonna probably win this fourth round. And then it's all up to the fourth round of KC's to see the back. fate of this map, pretty much. Time for a field test. I mean, if by I mean, if you look at the buy, I mean, if if this if this Three doesn't shardies. be a wallet for PA, they do have that they have bonus as well. The shorty cross. Oh, fine. Solar gets traded out by Snowy, and Rob is looking for more, but cannot find any three. Three already here with Vampire pushing down. out, finding. No, maybe finding a timing on Sal Taco. Oh, this could, this could go back. Oh, right here, Sal Taco. and that's nice to leave. Yeah, <laughs> yeah the shorty's here. I'm out of here. But Vampire is calling the rotates over for Fable, so he's gonna be able to be on the site. That's the and getting down. a specter. Yeah, look at Fable though, on site, ready to take that. He nope. <laughs> <laughs> on site, took the damage, instantly off site again. But Snowy gets Snowy. 50 games on C though. On the other side of that, but seems like Casey's looking to go fast here. Rap getting taken down. Remember, he's training fast. It's a 1v1 on site. Remember, he's winning it. Hey, so far! <laughs> he's so far, and there's nothing he can do. And I was just talking about how this round has to go PA's way for them to look confident in that, but it's not. Huh? It. <laughs> oh. <laughs> What? I think audio cues were somewhat something happened to them, but <laughs> uh, you know, you got the stick. It doesn't matter. <laughs> you got the round. Yep, yeah. got the round. Don't care about that. <laughs> Don't care about post round. Don't care about post round. Doesn't matter. Maybe dying for them. Do you don't even get money? I don't know. But look at the buy here. Look at Don't what is in rap hands right now. Oh, and I'm uh, uh, going with the. Oh, no, shield up. <laughs> Just going with the cannon. There's no blast here. There's nothing. It's just a cannon. He came down. He made, oh, Ooh, Solo, what a shot. Pick on 320. Early pick on 320. Lowering. They will not be able to get that off. Trucenti goes down. Take flight. Yeah. Maybe he's looking for more. Oh, no, he does find him out. Push right off of that eye. Oh, it <laughs> goes back to the angle. Uses the dash to go back to that angle. Can't it's true. <laughs> Look at Seller trying to challenge the off with a Marshall. <laughs> How confident is this man? But I mean, if you've got the guts, go for it, right? If it you, just like they juggle the gun away, so there won't be a gun for them waiting short. As Fable's getting called to A as well. Look at those pings in the map. Oh, this gun is still short. Hmm. I would like to see that gun being taken off from that position because they should identify that Pete is not looking good on that economy situation at the moment. Ooh, the flash gave me some false info. Left. Not finding anything long, but... They're still both here. They're still staying here. They were ready oh, for this. Coming out. Yep, Fable knows. Takes some damage, getting the one. Backing off, playing the retake with the team and... Solid decisions and St. Jason finds one of his own. 12 seconds on, Shiro needs to plant bomb here and 
three members. And they know where sure is, because the plant just went down. Yeah, all up to him, and does find one, but... Relatively clean round out of KC. I mean, they got to save the op, right? Yeah, they do keep the op. Man, oh. but I just want to highlight... I just want to highlight how different the KGs kind of play between the two teams where where PA is kind of like leaning this A side and pushing into the stack of KC while when they were defending they had the KJC garage mid area while giving up a full sight for free and KC keeps finding that hole while PA doesn't seem to be finding anything on this attack site currently at least but well, there's seen... only three rounds then I've not seen PA explore other sides of the map I mean, yeah, the bit of sight, they've just fully committed to it. That is true, and once again, the Omino coming out, spotting 2 on C, and still 4C long, trying to fight through here. It seems they have no intention of rotating or anything, just, hey, we decide on the map head, we're gonna go for it. There's the nothing wrong with that. But oh, they were finding a timing on 1, and on a second as well, getting trade out for Snowy, but... Empire spike has his back on site with bombs stuck in C long. I have the spike. A 2v4 for a KC and it seems all over PA right now. And this again comes back to that to the PA's mentality of just you know, if we, we see a site, we're gonna hit it no matter what. I've not seen them split into a site, I've not seen them, you know, attempt a site, but then if it fails, reposition. And maybe we can re-hit a site, we can reposition to hit a different site, but no, they're, they're just going in for that site. Yeah, and that's the site with the KG on it as well, so they're dashing into two mollies, into the turret as well with left. Fable and Empire playing off each other. It's just, that site's kind of impossible to hit without at least breaking some of the util first. But and that's where the Soba is also pretty helpful. You can just break KJ Util with a shock dart, whereas with you can't break any of the KJ Nano Swarms or the Alarm Bot with any of Sky's Util there. Yeah. Ten it is the same coming out of PA, smart. I would say their round is unwinnable. They get bring two rifles into the save round. Siller will have the nice as well, so that's another tool they can use. But that is 10, 11 on the board for KC. Clean map so far. I wish to see more out of PA here, but this yeah, round quite vital. We would definitely say Fable was the hero of that round. Just straight oh, up walked in, got Tricente, and managed to get Solar Zol off before getting traded. Yeah, three players dead, like right off his life only. It's worth every day. I would like to see PA play a bit slow slower here. Maybe. Breaking some, walking up, breaking some KJ Uto, get backing off, but careful. Looking like another fight here. See that now? He is a bit more running a split attack on C, a bit more. That's the problem of Omens playing from really far away. You can't end up smoking the whole time sometimes, and you just push it because they're so tense. Your team is calling for the smoke. They need that smoke immediately, or maybe that's a strategic smoke. You never know. But man, Rob picking. Bot mid, getting a pick on the Shacente. That's one down already for PA. And a rifle gone. He's not be able to buy the next one, so it's gonna look rough for the last round for him. But onto this A site where it's only seen to stick playing a solo lick position. Is oh, man, he has to get getting out of there. <laughs> no, he's the oh, he cancels it. Oh, yeah. he cancels it. He buys one, gets straight out for solo with the classic, and it's up to. Him is throwing on this A site by himself right now with Sao Taco kind of far away, oh. but whoa, damage onto Rav. And two oats coming out of KC. They really want this 12th oh. round, and it seems like they did the gun, but it doesn't matter with the defuse coming in. Don't think enough. Snowy is weak. It's already oh, happened. Man. Whoa, Sao Taco looking at the wall there. And it's kind of impossible to do anything. Yeah. With the sheer numbers. Match point. Are... You see, uh, I think we also might be going into a match point tech pause here. It's yeah, tech pause, yeah. Uh, statistic, be seeing him after a that tech play. Uh, <laughs> a tech. It's, 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 it's all it's all it's all types of pauses, man. 
Oh, We've got oh, multiple right. bosses running through, guys. <laughs> uh, yeah. So, so something's happening. Don't know what happened. It's I a mean, tech pause. For all those unaware, for all those at home, it's a tech pause. Scientistic had DC'd, and now he's back. So we can get rid of it. Yes, we should be coming back into the game. But I guess not. We're going into a normal timeout as well. Maybe Casey wanna, you know, they wanna talk over some stuff, you know. I mean, they, it, 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 they, they mistakenly hit the timeout yeah, button. Yeah. That, that's what it was. But I'll be honest with you guys. I'm uh, not gonna lie to the viewers. <laughs> no, lie to the viewers. But this is definitely the big range chat of a uh, tech pause into a timeout just to intimidate the other team. Or maybe they got. Such big range strats cooking up that they need more than the one minute allotted. Maybe this for this one last round that they need to close out this map, they're coming up with a strat that they will never see. Or maybe, or maybe, they're just going and refueling, oh. refueling their G Fuel soup. <laughs> what flavor G Fuel, G Fuel soup would you drink, Stabbed? What's your favorite G Fuel soup flavor? I've not tried any of, G, any of the G Fuel energy drinks, so I do not know. <laughs> Well, I mean, it's just the G Fuel cup. You're putting soup in it, so what flavor soup are you drinking in that G Fuel cup? Well, I don't know. I've not really, I've not had soup in a really long time, so I don't remember any of the any of the soup dishes as well. <laughs> I'm drawing a blank at the moment. I, I would imagine some nice thick clam chowder in my G Fuel cup, but we are coming into this round. Could be the final round of the Spike map, down. but Rav finding the first pick on a solo already. Not looking good. Enemy kill. My ult's okay. ready. Rav just got snowy out of the map real quick. And immediately <laughs> off of that. Man, TA. <laughs> TA's lost right now. They're like all garage area. They're like... Oh man, we lost two already. It's the round, and that's another one down. I am finding a oh, nice me. shot. They, they got they got to hit the B side, but nothing's connecting from Jacente. Getting over the body, taking it out. It's all just down, Taco B. in this flank position, and they don't seem to know to where he, she is right now. But oh, two twenty games away. Oh, two twenty yes, games finds something. Just like does find something, and that's the Defenders first map win. for KC. Lead map. Good, good job. Clean map! Nothing, no indeed. complaints from me from KC side, but man, stop it from PA. That was a great map. Uh, PA definitely would like to rework on their stuff. Looking but, at that scoreboard, look at it. Solar did a good, I would say Solar did a good job for PA. Man, Solar, highlight. Insane. That guy's a G Fuel soup drinker. <laughs> But look at the side of KC as well. The o Saintistic and Rav also getting four first bloods as well. Man, Saintistic has its omen. Bloodthirsty. Empire and Rav are, I feel like, two highlights. Rav on those entries, getting multiple, dashing into on a site. And Empire on these lurks, finding insane, Wait, like, multi frag Somehow on lurks. On lurks, usually, oh, you get one on a rotate and you back off and play. This annoying, like, need on your side playstyle, but Mempower is just dueling people out and winning. Yeah, it kind of reminds me of another game against PA that was on stream. I don't know. Some team named Solaris was playing against PA, and the, and the KJ oh. on the map was putting in some work on attack side. Not entirely sure. <laughs> yeah. Clean map coming out of KC, though. But Solar did have quite a performance. Popping the charts. We will be going to a five minute break, lane players rest, and we'll see you on map two.
Welcome back to Game 2 between KC Espresso and PA Cracked Capybaras. I am Shao and I'm just joined here with Stab and what a Game 1. That was indeed a great Game 1. Haven going on the side of KC, I think it was 13-5. A yep. great show from KC. I mean, PA looked kind of lost out there, but, I'm, but at the end they did get a few rounds, so... Maybe the second map will be a different play. Maybe we'll see. They got five cope, but it is Casey's map pick. So them being strong on it is expected. But we're going to Ascent, a well-known territory for PA. Nine games played on it already. So they definitely should look more comfortable on this map, at least. I'm looking at Casey's record on Haven. It, there, it was 6-1 prior to this map, prior to this game. So... I would have, I would have, I would have expected nothing less from them than a resounding victory. And no games played on ascent either, so don't know what to expect here. 
Maybe, maybe they've been cooking something. They might have been cooking. I mean, that's what he said about. Uh, that's what he said about PA oh. kind of on a Haven, but you only get one map ban. Lotus also a threatening map on the side of KC. Makes sense to ban it. So they need to have a strong starting ascent for me to really believe on them in this. That's the five because after that we're going to split another KC map. So let's see what we see on ascent here. Ooh, I'm excited for this Ascent map. Are we going to see these the most basic standard comp that we always see on Ascent? Oh, I hope not. I hope these guys are cooking, man. We are in Agent Select. Right. And a jet Agent is for locked that in for RAV already. Ooh, sure. Like, how are you Yoru hovers. Now? Ooh. The Yoru hovers are never real. I, I've just given up on the Yoru hovers. Ooh, Yoru hovers. Look at that. They're, they're just or Yoru hovers. You know, it's trolls at the moment. It, it, since there's four your hovers, it means there's a four times chance that they'll pick it. No, it means it's zero chance they're gonna pick it. There's only it's one like... person in this league that will play Yoru. Actually, there's a couple of people that will play Yoru, but so f or not, from here on out, there's only one person you'll see play Yoru, and which will be Karaya on Saturday. Um, please, Karaya, don't miss the finals. <laughs> <laughs> Plugging. Next game already, but it does seem like to be standard cost. But Saw Taco hovering the gecko. Would like, like to see that for the Viper pick. The Viper deadlock combo. Mm -hmm. Instead of the uh, Sova, so they're going with a single initiator instead of the double Sova and KO comp. PA looking to be the standard comp, Choose not that exciting. Just trolling. Pierce just Pierce just deciding the comp on the fight. They're they're spinning the wheel right now. They're like, hey, okay. This agent landed on this, this comp. You know, this is this stops with fear now. What? It's the, the most same... boring comps in the world. It's not my boring fear. It's it's that everyone plays the same comp on the map. We play the same comp on the map. It's the same comp no matter what. <laughs> There's a reason this comp's always placed, Bab. It's good. Yeah, but someone has to come up with the new meta, especially for Ascent. You, you know, you know where the meta starts right here at VDC, the meta the fighting league. You can define it, and if it gets, I mean, are we saying VDC is not popular to set a meta yet? To set a meta? All I want to say is, when I started playing, Yoru, Yoru will become meta. I'm the trendsetter, but there's not many trends being said here in this game so far, two basic comps. This time, PA is starting on the attack side, on their own map pick. Let's see how that goes. It is true, and... Ooh, Rav going for that Sheriff play. Right off the bat. Feeling confident from their performance. Never nope. Mind. Go to your guest. <laughs> hey, he heard you talking. It also seems that our producer is not following uh, the Observer. Which is unfortunate, but it will be fun. As... Yeah, looking, to... looking for a fight mid, both sides. Either way, you'll take anything, but. No, most of PSA. Just sent it here. Right. But look at that remaining of PA looking to get uh, get started on A side. Where the KJ is sitting already. Ready. That push. It's not gonna happen. Carrot taken out. No. Oh, it does get that the tag. Oh, both balls out. Raph wants to lurk their mid. And Solar. Does clear out the site. There is nothing here for KC, as they should have a site here. But look, all full of KC members ready to retake. PA yeah, kind of stuck PA's in. members very loud. Yeah, both Sova and Jet. One shot. And Shadows traveling. Oh, dodge, just dodging under the dart. But St. Fistic finding South Taco already. In the first of the retake. That's the second one. Fighting another? Okay, one sure. enemy remains. Saint Tissa gets one. Nothing. All up to Snowy back here in the AMA position, getting flanked by Rav, and nothing you can do Rav there is. as Pistol goes KC's way. Very retake. Just giving up one on site, having the remaining four players ready for retake. Good yeah. round. Especially Rav, getting that early pick on the lurker Don't forget mid. Who you are, Omen. Just 
removing that problem on Casey Slot. Don't have to think about oh, is some guy gonna come late tree and backstab us and just makes that retake for them so easy. There are already four members surrounding the A site as the bomb was going down. Yeah, they were ready for that retake. Look at this trap going for the early yeah. round. That's what they did early, in. Yeah. yeah, that's what uh, Fable did last time. Went with the early Phantom the last time they won pistol. Yeah. They are exploring LB with the dart. Finds nothing, backs off as. Ooh. They're walking up mid. Empire is just spot, should find some. Duck. What a shot. Oh. Two shots coming out, Rob. Getting both. This man is Bad cooking up. this game, but. Solar is trying to find something, getting droned out, and. As soon as he's stuck and in the position, he just chooses not to dash out. Drone does find oh. Solar's as well. Rob. Well, it's not connecting until the last few, but he is low. It doesn't seem to matter though, as it's all up to Snowy. Find himself this mid site. He's reveal that that's a flawless coming on the side of KC. I mean, this fourth round for PA is gonna be rough. Rav with this rifle, Judge, and a Bulldog. They're, KC is quite strong for this bonus. They yeah, definitely do have the guns to win this round. Especially that judge. I'm sorry, you'd think I'd say the handle, but no, that judge is looking deadlier than any other weapon on the side of KC. <laughs> yeah, this judge currently going to the B site, the opposite of where all of Here. all of PA is coming, so they should be thankful for that, but they are going to hands a Rav, who has been quite a demon so far in this map, finding five for the first two rounds already. And they're back on it, so... Okay, back to this mine position. That turret is broken down, by the way. From the side of KC, so we're sending yeah. to be careful of that push. Oh, oh what a fine point! Really, what a good But Rav trades on the other side of the map. Oh, he get out. Yeah, uses dash. Does get out safely. Both sides traded, but on this side of KC, it is the silver down, so that mid run info will not be found. But it is another <laughs> gun down for PA, which does hurt the economy. Well, Casey just loses a Spectre, not too much to be worried about. Look at Jacinta though, still hold up in mid. Now finally making a move out from Tiles. Yeah, it does seem like... Cutting noise is gonna be this A hit here. Fable. Should be spotting. Yeah, Fable should have spotted Jacinta here. here on the walk-up. I mean, this 1v1 is gonna be crucial. And what they're looking for, but it seems like they think left. it's a mid hit with a smoke down arches. But no, Fable is rotating over. The blind is coming through as PA members are flying onto site, coming back site. The volley not connecting with Rav back. Oh, he's so gets cleared he out. But Saint Justic gets oh, a trade. Saint Justic gets a trade in tree with just the one blinded and left. nothing can be found. But two members low on the side of PA. Definitely win a bow for the. Rifle and Bulldog in the hands of Statistic and Empire. The other tree and Statistic oh, finds the first one. Last That's two players are both one shot, but not I looking behind us. Taco playing the lever position. That's no both positions, though. That should have given a both their positions. Those both positions, both players are one shot. Definitely one of them both from Empire as this KJ is trying to find something. Jumping oh. onto the generator as Noe playing in the tight corner. Not in Empire's mind to check it, and that's. A stressful round fourth PA. round for PA. Yeah, did give up three guns though, so those three players will be looking to play with lower weapons. Well, they, they found weapons because they do win the round, so. But look at 320 games coming out with the Odin. Immediately. <laughs> Odin gated. And PA's four members here does seem to be coming Ooh. for. Ooh. That's a... That's a, a new cage attack I've never seen. I'm not that in my playbook. <laughs> uh, 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 so this is coming in. Not sure where the bullets are going. <laughs> I'm gonna see that if that head is gonna be useful. But man, look at the silver lineup. These players, these players are coming from type paired. I'm guessing that's a uh, that's a fake lineup. That's a that's a, that's a dart towards A or towards maybe. Mid? But all five oh, members are coming to uh, B side. Yeah, and there's two. There's oh, Empire two. Oh. making early. The dart comes out as the jet, jet dash comes in onto the left position. Oh, oh, oh. oh. Hovering on top of the. 
Bow House, but Sheriff's DP does finally clear out. 320 games on the back side. It's all up to this retake. It's a 3v3, three three three. definitely three. little from both sides of the team. But Snowy with, with the Odin. Yeah, I'm already coming in. Left the knives. Only five bullets on his knives, and if he does not use them, it's gone. Both of just does uh, not have a to get rid of the bleed stone. Early aggressive push by Sao Taco finds nothing of value, so it's all up to. Now, oh, just okay. Sarshiro in this back sight, looking in the wrong direction as Raph takes him out. Another and clean round. Yep, yeah, Casey just great on the retakes. Man, it felt quite solid for P on the way in. 3v3. Re uh, post plant and Casey's retake just seems so clean. Well, Odin picked up and Rav now has the yo oh, yeah. Man, that's definitely giving me something to look out. How will PA deal with this op? But man, I don't understand this buy from PA though. Snowy going for a vandal buy, a hero rifle. Hero rifle, maybe put some hope in this round. Does have the O and one orb, so we'll have that online next round. This but orb. nope, the Deagle Bite does come out. Ooh, this up. Behind, maybe peeking here. Not funny. Much of value uh, as the dark uh, comes out. Oh, it. we'll find him. Oh, that's Ooh. unfortunate. Oh, that's oh. much unfortunate as the dash needs to be used. But up still in the hands. And shots still not connecting on both on sides. Ooh, looking solid. Look solar. Solar. But. But same distance is keeping it. Just a... Should know. Oh, yep. Definitely deal, knows though. now, but. Does he know about the rest of PA? <laughs> All holed up in this Careful. A main area. As the yeah, flash comes there. out, the hits, the smoke comes out, the hits coming in. But, oh, ooh, Fable not finding anything, and that's a rifle for Snowy. As so they, you, you will be looking to pass on that rifle to somebody. Pass on that rifle. Getting off, floating on this U2 and <laughs> this Silvo I was talking about earlier, now online, playing this aiming position. Three members with leaving Stellar for Classic back hell. Ooh, what a <laughs> shot coming through. Up. Brady Blake that is scary. Well Look at what Chisente is right now, mid. Statistic is checking, but what he expects and thinks so late here. I doubt it. But oh, this could be done. Oh, no. no. Oh, oh, that Molly should know. be yep. But Sheriff finds two, hey, mate. So it's all up to. He's trying to gain this is Odin, but he does not find Solar on your backside and Thrifty for PA. It all happened so quick. Oh, and the out picked up as well for Solar. Oh my god. That's a that's a swing round for PA. The economy is not looking great for KC. But man, that round. We're so focused on Tracendant's flank, seeing with that Molly and see if you'll find one. We, we ignored Sh Shiro getting three from A main. And what the kind, that's what the spams do, right? I mean, Rice trying to nerf them, but lessening the uh, magazine count. Doesn't matter. We're still, we're still spam through the smoke. Yeah, and then. Solar with that classic down in hell. Finding one in the end there, getting 320 games where he's trying to spam out Shiro, but it's a slow around here in Stoey. County <laughs> spamming 320 games. That's Odin Gaming right there. That does make the B side definitely weaker. Yeah, 100% weaker. It's calling. Which draws the rotation. Have to rotate. Yeah. Well, he just does a shorty, so. Playing this tight position while well, already walked up. Tricente is. You can see what's position. You can get one. Ooh, but statistic. Doesn't have the weapon off. for it, though. I mean, the Stinger yeah. does wonders. Tricente knows. Tricente hears statistic right there. Pinging it out as the dart is broken, knowing. Oh, yeah. like a solid A hit coming out. But, oh. Look at statistic. Oh, Ooh, clean kill guard, statistic. How crucial. Uh, oh, gets another. Finds another one. Oh, but look at Snowy. Snowy. Oh, just not. Wait, and look, look at Vampire flanking the flank, but does not find anything either. As uh, Snowy left. does find the one they one need, and remaining. Solar with that op, it gets a rap shorty. Nothing he can do, but welcome to Flank City. Oh yeah, welcome to Flank City. But they expect Vampire in this position. Solar definitely thinks he could be a main, but oh, but Snowy, Snowy's oh, there. Snowy knows. Or is ready for that push to a tree. Shiro, up well. your heaven, looking at the CT area, does not expect something to glass it. 
That's a step, no? Yeah, I heard a step as well. No, wait, no, it's oh. mines over the Odin, and man. Another run for you to tie it up, yeah. Watch them run when lit by I feel like these anchors That's aren't finding much start. value for the side of KC now. The executes on this map just seem so much more clean out of BA with the dash, the omen. Solar just allowed to kind of cook on the entry and Shiro some hero plays on some of these rounds, getting 3 A main in that one round and it just seems so much more cohesive for this PA squad. It seems like Fable hasn't been able to get any picks while anchoring on that A side, especially thanks to his box. Yeah. But it's gonna be a battle with Ops here as Oh, it's her coming on top. Does not spot anything. Uh, it yeah. spots now. But oh, oh these are off shots connecting. But <laughs> lucky oh. for a re peek. That's Maybe Ella nice. buys that oh, Solar's okay. holding him now. Ooh, <laughs> he's dashing out. The more the more sensible decision. The volley, the blind coming out, trying to support. Man, these two offs are just trying to face off each other. But it seems to be that on the side of KC, Rabbit winning stuff. out with Snowy getting attacked through a wall, losing half their health. Oh, look Cut. at Fable. Fable wants it. Does Fable want the smoke? I doubt he does. does... He knows that's all his position. <laughs> but knife again? Okay, no one's close. Don't need to peek it anymore. But oh, <laughs> look at that knife. That value it's getting, getting, I believe, both Omen and all four players yeah. on the site here. Oh, the, three, the game from 3 games could be good there. With Pizza, the but Jacente, oh! Not expect to kill out Jacente, but gets it nonetheless. Left. As Mempire would meet, oh, Snowy, yes. Snowy finds the wall bang through it. Two insane kills coming out of PA side. Will he find one oh, more? Yes! Gets a little pick on the Man, that's so lucky to be in Fable's position. Looking at the KJ running downstairs and Snowy in this pizza area. <laughs> the two Odin's go in on each other. Odins. We had the op, we had the jet up as a jet up at the beginning of the round, and now we have the solo Odin. Solo Odin. Solo Odin over solo Odin, but Snowy doesn't seem to be looking mid and Gone. easy kill for the three games, but yeah. it's all up to him. Rev, that's the op down for the side of KC. Oh, what a flash. No oh, position as Vicente. I didn't even find his either, so it's now 3v1. Trying. It's gonna be two games, what? Does that taco have that op? No, hasn't picked up the op yet. Just protecting the op. Revealing area. Not allowing them to save the op. It might be a safer to Odin. Maybe try to wrap Cat in quite a mid, but I doubt he'll find anything much. Save out of here. It's another round for PA. What a different story, despite it being just 4-3, it feels like PA has been in such a strong position so far in this game. Yeah, I mean, if you look at the scoreboard, Manfire and Fable have not been able to get any kills on the board. Again, kills don't mean everything bad. Yeah, I would say that. Like, both Manfire and Fable are their respective side anchors. Fable on this A, usually, but move over to mid, try to be a bit more aggressive. Well, I feel like... They have not been put into positions to succeed because of how clean the executes of PA are. Every time I see them on my screen, they're either blinded or stunned or like droned out. And it's just a jet dashing on them and nothing they can do to like really do, to really like live. So clean attack coming out of PA. I want to see some more aggression out of Casey's side. Maybe with this uh, Savol, he does have the Odin here, but it's going to be a save probably on the other four members. Yeah, so they'll be trying to, you know, at least have one player with 320 games and also that if 320 games does die, they'll be able to pick up that Odin and get the trade off. Oh, 100%. This Odin is probably the one condition of this round, and look at his creds, 50. That <laughs> If he dies here, loses the Odin... Next round, it's going to be four guns and him with a classic. Oh, the shield instantly when you mentioned the 50, 50 creds remaining. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, exactly. Odin, no shield. It's not a sight you see often, but maybe one they need right now as... Oh, oh the Pyro's Crunch. As they're going fast and not finding anything yet. Solar just not oh. finding a shot, dashing out. But it's five members of PA fighting five members of KC in this mid area. And the Stingers come flying. The Odin does as well, but the Nano Swarm fights two. And Shiro cleans up the other ones. All up to 320 games with Odin by himself in market. Nothing much he can do, but finds the first one as they cross. And Shiro cleans them up. And 
What a round in action! Just an all-out brawl mid. I feel the strain. Block it out, Omen. That move it. The part I that mean... I that that the KO flash pairs well with that the play that KC just did is a, is the jet knives. That flash gets most of the people, and then you can easily pair with the blade storm to either get one or two there. But yeah, exactly. They got P on the back foot of that flash. Solar was scrambling away, getting tagged with the stingers, but they just couldn't close out with the stingers, not connecting with their bullets, and ultimately, it is a pretty clean round for alive for PA. But oh, this Odin spam could be beautiful. Look at this two players A are out already, so you they know run. it's 5B main. With the Hunter Stereo time. coming to break out, like all this map control for. KC, they know five players have to be in this garage area, but wait, there goes the KJ you told. As three members on lane, does not connect with Crystal Club, but Shisante trades them out, but Sinistic finds one of his own. It's left to a 2v3 in the favor of KC, and nothing can be found because Spike is stuck in lane while all three members of KC holding this cross. But Sinistic stuck here. Oh, bullets not connecting, but those do want to. Rob, but Fable treats him out. First one of the game for him. And labored round for KC, but they do get one board after that. Isn't they definitely not happy with, with his voice not being able to penetrate for that wall? <laughs> 100%. But in the end, 4 or 5 score line so far. It should be buys on both sides. Rav dropping one of his teammates, popping the knives. But Look at Solar. Solar is never. So Solar's only opt when he's picked up the op. Otherwise, he's chosen to go with the rifle. Thing. Yeah, especially he's playing those like heavy entry dashing in, and op isn't really suited for that. As he kind of one ways himself, but ooh, dashing in, ooh, not getting across with the thing. As they get one more of the three twenty games, as three twenty games wins it out. But saw Taco hot on his heels with the flash. Zero trading him out to end. It's two on site four. He already has Raph with the nice fast retaking the site, flooding in. It's too stuck on site. He's trying to get a plant down Shiro, covering his teammate well and getting another onto Fable. All up to the Empire with this lockdown by himself. He's trying to flush out these PA members. But it is a 2v1. Oh, and, oh, what a TP. Right behind him. Nothing Vampire can do about that. Ankles broken on Shiro. Four kills on that round. Yeah, that's a clean up and given. Yeah, and this is definitely looking like PA's map pick here, you can tell. Their experience of playing nine times on this map is showing. And at 320 games, held onto the site for quite a while, taking out Solar, the like point of the spear, but Shiro, like right behind him, taking 320 out, then taking two more, and then the end with that quite a nice play, TPing behind Vampire, who had no idea where he gone. And it puts KC kind of on a save. Raf does have the rifle, but it's Bucky's and Eagles on the other few members. But, well, oh, the oh, Bucky does find Halley Vampire in this gen position. And <laughs> he's fighting for his life, and Ultimate gets taken out as one more goes Shiro's way. Fable dead in this glass position, and two tree and one flanking will get spotted by this. Oh, what if he got a Raf? But not expecting anything back sight. What can Statistic and 320 games do with these two deagles? So far, not much as 320 gets taken out. It's all of Statistic. Oh, what a peek out. But I doubt we'll find anything as Snowy cleans up this round. It's 7 on the board for PA. Now they have 103 back up again for Snowy. And Tresente's off 1 off the lockdown too. Whereas on the side of KC, they're nowhere close to any, all, any of the alts other than 220 games just being 3 away from the alt orbs. Yeah, we'll see if he will ultimately get that, maybe a we'll orb, 2 kills, something like that, but... I would expect an orb grab coming out of this KJ and maybe ulting down, have nothing to break it early in the round. As they're coming to his A site with just the KJ, Vampire got to play with the hold of his life to stop this rush. But you all the KC run. knows right now. Here comes a lock on the side of PA for that attack that we just talked about. 
Well, no one is playing right now. Exactly what a pocket is. Finding Zola already, and to stop on a second, Shiro being so clean in his duels. But two on the flank. Bot should know already, and Casey is just trying to clamp down on these players. Here comes the paranoia. Just, oh. and, like, is it's all up to Snowy in this one position, and the Heaven guys are coming down with two players, Jen, feeling the pressure on both sides, but Statistic gets caught out as Rav gets caught out as well, it's Fable, it's a 1v1 between these two initiators, Snowy still has the ton of fury ready, but knifed out, not able to do anything, but the dart, such a thorn in the side, Snowy just playing with him. So hard for Fable to hold the spike, and nothing he can do right now. But 40 HP dies to one of those Hunter Theory ticks, and that's 8 4 half for PA. What night and day from that first map? Switching well, literally, to switch up because the first map we had KC uh, at the half 8 and 4, and now PA on their map pick leading 8 and 4. So, are we gonna see a repeat of map 1 where PA run it down with 13 5 with 3? That sounds like possible, maybe. I mean, that starts with a pistol round out of KC if we want to be exact, but. Shiro having such a different game from map one. This ascent seems to be his playground, having insane moments on both B and A site. Let's see what he can do playing in this tree area. Looks like it's gonna be a fight for TAA main as KJ in Sova. Are playing slightly more passive here as it's just fast out of KC. Dark's coming out, knife's coming out, flash coming out, everything dashing over as Tricente's bullets not connecting. It's all up to him playing himself as his mollies do connect, but statistic of 320 clearing out the site. It's all up to these three rotators in a 4v3 post plant. Spike planted. As Timmy gets some information. Yeah, South Taco is still miles away from being a factor in this, but let's find something. Vampire playing just playing by stairs. As man, Casey just want to fight them despite being in a good retake position. But three, if three peeking from stairs, Shara finds the second of this round. But time is clicking. Time is ticking. Will he be able to check his logs and clear out CT in enough time? But no, oh, he gives him the one as Vampire re peaks at 1 HP. Oh my god. It's definitely winnable. Both of them were on HP, but it is the wrap of KC. It is prophesized. I'm calling it. We're seeing it 13 8. 13 8. That's your prediction? Yes. Well, I mean, last round, they won the pistols, they lost the force. And it ended up being a 13-5. What we seen is, so you're saying they will win Time this, get another round, test. get to up to eight. It's over, yeah. Well, okay. we'll get a few rounds in between, but I'm guessing it's 13. Okay, okay. But well, it is a A side lean coming out of PA, which is a perfect read as five members of KC exploring here. Green line. Good decision. Ooh. Main dart lineup doesn't find anything. It's bash wrap out already. Just sent the attack by the dart, taken out. Zola trades well with the classic, oh and he finds, somehow finds two of his classic. Vampire is running out as he gets straight out as well. It's all up to 320 by himself, Last getting collapsed through tree. It's a silver 1v1, knowing where both positions are. How tense is the situation as. <laughs> oh my god, right up and under each other. Oh, find the foot. And that's the final thing. 320 games clutches out with four on the round. And with a phantom as his reward. I mean, they got the round, but it came down to the wire. <laughs> it did. So that would be a good round inside of PA because they got rid of four guns there. Surely the phantom was salvaged back again, but four guns. Have, so having uh, the rest of the team for KC to go on low buys, Deagle buys, whereas uh, PA will be on their full buys here. That is true, three Deagles for the side of KC. Just that Phantom 4 through 20 games is the point of contact for them right now as they're all exploring mid with these weaker weapons that we have. Just loves going in, the Stinger 
Meteor Cosmic Snowy does not get taken out, but Fable gets the trade and <laughs> they ride three with his Phantom, Mid. but like I highlighted at the start of this round, it's all up to three turn the games with this Phantom of his own. But he is getting constricted by the members PA with one outlet being this B site. But Shira is looking to cut him off as Solar doesn't want any part of that getting the blind and looking for a fight. But it's all up to him. And Relatively clean force round coming out of PA. I would be happy with that if I was them. This does this does mean that KC now have a good weapon by here as well. That Along is true. With PA, so it'll be a good round to match. It's gonna be five rifles. Those are five rifles. The first run where that is happening this half, and with such a performance from three twenty games on the first round and. Solid on second as well. He already has that 8.0 up already. That 100 fairy could be so impactful this third round where it's so pivotal because there's three. There's, there's rifles on both sides. But, but KC is exploring this Eco Roger area. <laughs> so I just want to take a fight. Picking both top mid and link. Oh! oh. Find statistic and that's the smokes players down. Sorely needed roll on these XX and now that's a that's some breaks on KC's plans as Swain hits some more. So much was looking at and what and what a find from Empire. Winning the fight, Amen as the Ravage is running in, trying to wrap around stairs. Does Tristante no and no finds the timing on the CT but does not take it. And Snowy finds the timing of his own and mark it. We can't land, but the stock specs still playing dashing in. Getting taken out. It's all up to Tresente here. It finds the first. Number 320 games. Both on this B site. With Shiro. 30 seconds left. Vampire. Nowhere to be found, but. Ooh, it's just KJ Lurk. Does not take the timing. Oh, Shero getting a wall bang, but Empire finding one of his own. Now it's the one v one between Omen and KJ. He needs to find him, but Shero's bullet is just connecting faster than his. So, ten rounds for PA. Good round came down to the wire. Empire's alert just a little bit too late, so could not help three twenty games to get onto site. Plus, Tresente did have his lockdown ready to go. So, I mean. Oh, three twenty games. What a pivotal round to win too. Yeah. Both ecos would have been a shambles if one side lost. And now, on the side of uh, KC, a Bucky coming out, two Stingers, a Deagle. That would be really hard pressed for them to win this round. But they are hitting this B site where just the Silva sits. But such info coming out, and what a smoke! Very out here. Yeah. You should run. Oh, is investing this lockdown on this eco round? Not get any damage in the no shock. No damage from the shock cards. And oh, we kind of have a team flash here, but that is the site for KC. They do have the stingers and buckies for them to hold it at least. <laughs> oh, look at this! Oh, oh. <laughs> look at Rav! <laughs> Poppy out of smoke with the buggy, finds nothing of value though, and Solar takes him out. It's a 4v5 now. Able in this log position with the thing. He gets tracked by Snowy and taken out as well. And Snowy finds another 320 games at Soma Dip. And it's all up to these One two players enemy. on the site as they're both getting crushed by the might of PA. <laughs> it's over. <laughs> they were like, wait, really over? I thought there were more people left to play with. Yeah. But, I mean, clean retake on PA. It was a weak, weaker weaponry from the side of KC, so I was surprised they invested that lockdown. They won't have that to use for this pivotal gun round. But they will have pretty much all four other ults, one off of Ravs. But look at us, head of PAs. Pretty much all ults except for Saltacos, which isn't far off either. Another heavy A lean towards this Patriot site. Another buy round. Definitely one that, that KC would like to convert because if they lose this, that's over. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'd say. Hiding from the start, giving some false info. Four players in this 
and B lobby. Walking up, playing some contact to be made. But man, Solar just finding the kill. Mid across the map. Yes. No, he's relaying the info as all of them coming out, but the Dari coming out, getting some damage on the Rav, but Rav's returning some damage of his own on the Snowy and free sight for KC, but at what cost? Rav is quite low and it's a 5v4 with Sal Taco on the flank. All four members here. Dock on sight. Not very much coming out. Here comes the lockdown. From the Here comes the lockdown. We'll use that front, front lane, but oh, what a tiny found by Solar finding two players. Hit. Oh, not finding that oven, but now Conco does. It's up to three tap. Three turning games in this backside position of Solar. He does have the Dari, but shocked out of his own. Finding two and Chero, the running gun, cleans him up. That's 12 on the board for PA. They almost lined up. Could have gone both of them. Almost lined up. Almost lined up. And that might be the nail on the coffin. Yeah, the loss yeah. bonus does help them out, having quite a few rifles still. Three rifles, a guardian, and a judge. Not too shabby of a buy for the side of KC. We'll be able to contest this map point here. We'll be contest. Four rifles, knives coming out of Rav. And it was three ults used on the side of PA, so that is something to bank on, but. Saw Taco of her all up now. And man, look at this map. No one on the B side of the map right way. now. But Casey's looking to change that. All running over to spot. That was a good read from PA, by the way, to just stack A side because they're worth that push. Yeah, as they feel no pressure, they're rotating over. Not finding anything being made yet. And both teams just kind of consent. Content to keep it slow, but look at how Taco position quite dangerous. Not expecting my fire to be pushed up already. That's the cat gone. It's so hard for Tristan to put the side, but Rav wrapping up, finding two. It's all up to oh, finding more right click snowy, getting that as well. So it's all up to Tristan in this pivotal round for KC. Is this where it all changes? <laughs> Hey, Rav, no way they would accept Rav here. Yeah, four and around for Rav. What? Around for him. Playing up everything on B site. What a monster. Richard nice putting in a lot of work. I mean, I feel like that's kind of messy around for PA. They just had no one watching mid. Rav walks up and just gets two for free. Yeah, I think the zero point was used really early on into the round and. Did not get any info and did not come back in time to be able to get that info on it when pushing up catwalk. Yeah, true. They were just playing two passive spots. Mid and no info gathered. Raph find the timing. Good on them for that. But now we're in the second round. We're in the next round. Five plays for KC all in the same vein. Super point and recon being used to clear <laughs> tiles and be made. There is no info over on A. Unless yeah, no but... info is good info. Look at this cool play is playing this tree. And with the smoke coming out as well, so it's gonna be so hard for them to walk out of the A main choke. But the flash is coming down, finding nothing, Shiro in the air. Or Rav in the air, I have to say. Shiro finding him. him down. And they both stuck on a cross. Oh no, that's the spike stuck on the left. And it looks like it's all falling apart for KC as. Three already taken down, they're all stuck in A main, but 320 games, race of life back into the round as he takes down Solar, but it's all up to him with 1 HP. And Tresente closes it out as it's map Defenders 2 going on the PA side, tying up the series 1-1. I mean, clean. I mean, what an answering map for PA compared to that first one. I mean, they showed them why it's their map pick. Exactly, and... I sure played that I'm, really well. I mean, actually, everyone on the side of PA played really well. Yeah, on... After that first map, what's kind of concerns for PA? They look sloppy on Haven, but... Maybe it's just bad map for them, and now this is such an exciting series. Where, now it's tied 1-1, both maps look quite dominant for their respective teams. 
This makes me think we're going to five map here. This makes me think we're going to all five maps here. Maybe. Maybe we finally get the prophesized five map banger that we are promised. But. I mean, the that elite is... maps between these two teams, between those two franchises, went for five maps. Oh, maybe maybe something about KC versus PA brings out some banger games. But that was just map two, and we will be taking a five minute break before we head to map three. We see you then.
Welcome back, everyone, into map three between PA Crack Cafeteras and KC Espresso. I mean, PA answered back in that second map, so we now have a series on our hands, and we're going to split in the third map. How do you feel about that? Just please don't go to map five. Don't go we to map work. five? You don't yeah. want that five? We have work tomorrow. We are working individuals. Come on. It's currently 10 p.m. EST on a Wednesday night, and I'm ready for this to go to a 3 1 a.m. banger at least. I'm I mean, that. that's why I signed up for casting a best of five at <laughs> starting at 8 10. Well, I was hoping that one of the teams was just completely outclassed the other. I didn't expect a great game on our hands. I mean, both teams answering on their maps, choosing what, telling us why they chose those maps to be their map picks. That is true. Strong map for Haven for KC and strong map of Ascent for PA. And now we're going to split a KC map. If our previous maps have shown, there should be a strong showing from KC. But as we're in an agent select, a Silva hover from 320 games, not a common sight on this map. I was going to say the momentum that the other team had from the previous map should carry over to this map, but. That wasn't the case for KC when they played on Ascent, so I don't know how, how it worked for PA this time. That is true. As I'm still fixated with slight comp differences with Rav favoring, seems like to be favoring this chamber over to Jet from Solar as 220 no, games still hovering the Silva. Yeah, there's no, yeah, other than that, there's like no actual holding Sentinel ish. Agent, like how you, on the side of PA, they're hovering with a cipher. But on it's this true. side, the only Sentinel is Zarab here. I mean, not saying Cypher can hold a site, he can, but. I mean, Rav has been quite on fire these two maps, so. Yeah. Maybe his guns are the holding power you're talking about. Maybe that's all they need <laughs> to hold the site. Uh, Select the site. The double agent. duelists are locked in for the side of PA. So we're guaranteed that. So. I'll just send table with the Cypher, if he wants to pivot KJ last second, but I doubt he will. There we go. As the Silva does not come match. in. As it's another Mira matchup. I mean... Cypher's not exactly the most popular, so that is... It's kind of surprising we've got two of them this map. I mean, Split is Cypher's playground, right? I mean... <laughs> split is Cypher's map. I mean, if you're not going to pick Cypher on this map... I wouldn't say you're trolling, but if you don't, if you know how to play Cypher, you always pick Cypher on the split. That is true. Cypher players do love a good split game, but let's see, 320 games, moving off his previous two roles of playing Initiator both maps onto this Cypher now. And the same could be said for Tresente, who did play the KJ last map, but the one yeah, before look. that. Yeah, looked much more comfortable on the well. Sentinel pick. Yeah, looked mu looked much more comfortable on the Sentinel play. Yeah, I want to point out, subs still on both sides. On map three here, so oh, this is a nice spot. Well, <laughs> you know, that's, that's some of the unlucky bounces out of Cipher. But look at KC right now. No, not a four uh, members. Our Robin I'm already running up. Nail. <laughs> it blinded already and. Not funny thing, as South Tango chases them out, is the grenade finds Vampire! <laughs> sure, get to Chiro, well, on the back end. Hex Saintistic, but. The Cypher 1v1 does go through 320 ways, so he finds the timing up in heaven. And all of A Sight is his for now. I'm Calling Fable to rotate enough. over. Yeah. Took 320 games here. Let's find something, but. I hope PA does know that their Cypher was taken down A, so all of that side of the map is dead. And, oh, it's a hey, lucky timing over? for Snowy. Knowing, and worst timing for Twin Tony Games. Left F24 HP with the knife out, Shara. Oh. The Fable That's should be able to get this plant down. Nothing on Cypher M, so it's gonna be a free plant down. As PA hears it, all starting to rotate over. Seems like an unlucky round, unlikely round out of Fable, but 
Taking this up aggressively. Up right here. Main. Right here, right now. Ooh, finds the timing up heaven. But it's not planned for heaven, so he needs to go fast here. I don't hear anything. Oh, Lord. Shot Kness, get the first one. No damage taken, so his health bar is easily so intact. Oh, yeah, take it. It's just sticking as how Taco holding an extra screen, so. The first starting pistol is going PA's way. And then this I is mean, more not planning for heaven, planning really safe. Yeah. Work against Fable there. Like, he, he had all of Ace Eye. I think he could have played Heaven, but that's with the Observer's view, so I don't know what he was thinking. But I feel like the main part of that round was that Vidify, three players dropping for KC instantly. 10 seconds in a round, Rav dashing up, not finding anything where Snowy could get behind that box. And then Vampire just dying to a nade. But it seems to be a bit slower out of KC side this round. Here. Ooh, dust flash arrow. Yeah, Shara sure does spot it. Sure. And maybe a pop flash out of the smoke. In a dash right too. Not finding anything. Shara finding Fable punishing him for missing that dash so. Rav just left in this position. <laughs> Lucky had the nade popping behind him and Shara taking the opportunity to push out and getting another freezy pit and St. Disney finds a nice kill with that classic on the South Taco with going the double ding. And so does Vampire. It's a rare. Both sides are kind of falling now. And look at the spike running through CT spawn. Going to A. As St. Tistic falls on B site. This and Spectre could, could win the game for them if played really well. Could win the game for them. Or at least around, but 22 HP matching the number of bullets he has, but. Plant goes down once again. It is a 3v2. Wait, three different games. Let's find info. Bombardy out. And oh, but it's not spot. The oh, just remaining. spot the other. Oh, still Sorry, does not dude. know about the other. But Sola finds them. Should know now. And takes one out. But Arrow cleans up with three in a round. So we actually did spot Manfire there when she jump peeked out of that out of heaven. I love explosions. But <laughs> Sola is that Marshall is such an awkward angle to play. Two rifles, or a Bulldog and a Spectre saved on the side of PA. Not the strongest bonus in the world, but they'll take it. We take those. We got the round down. You're That's expected down, to lose yeah. this one. Three classics for PA. Maybe a Marshall out is in Solar's hand, but other than that, not much firepower. Looking for more of a B hit here on the side of KC here this time. Yeah, more exploring Which is mid. Yeah. Fable and Rav do love walking up mid together, but has not worked in the world. But hasn't worked too well. But Blinded. still playing the game plan as a one v one is happening on a ramp and Silla is peeking out with the Marshall taking out three turning games. A rifle down on the side of KC. But Spike is on the other side of the map. Three members garage. <sighs> Straight to the cypher trip. Off of that. New cypher trip and Soma smoke too. It's so hard to walk out of. Fable's dog won't play the trip as Solaris Marshall will be posted up. Backside of B here. And look at Rav. Precision is holding. Thank you behind the rim. And oh, oh the Marshall Bloods do not connect, but he's looking for more. Re peeking again. And Ooh. that one does connect. Rav with the rifle finds one on Snowy. And now all of A site is KC's. How fast can PA run over and recover the site? 30 seconds left. Yeah, I'm pretty sure Shira heard uh, Synthistic rotate through mid there. So he will have to keep clear off their mid peasant as well. I mean, that nade finds so much damage, but Sautaku does get past it. Just a classic though. And it's so important that Snowy fell oh, because Snowy was the one with the rifle. Oh, what bad timing from Satistic turning around looking at heaven and Rav jumping but saves it with a clean headshot on a South Taco. But Rav one, one health. Fable with the heal. Pulling him back at least to half. And it's a 3v3. In a deep position, CT coming out. But Jacenta coming out, finding his with the Spectre. Fable is left by himself on the site. 
Not finding much for Shiro, and it's off to Rav playing heaven with 60 HP. Not knowing, oh, now they know with the spam, not connecting the bomb half, so nothing that can be found, and that's the bonus round coming in for PA. Thrifty. Good retake on the side of PA. Isolating each and every one of those on the side of KC there. Oh, 100%. I mean, that round looked tragic for KC at the start where 320 gains fell in A main, but then it seems like Raph kind of brought it back. Taking down Snowy, the person with the rifle picked up out of 320. And now, oh, early timeout coming out of Empire. So only fourth round in. But that round looks so good for KC. What happened to make them lose that post plan? Well, Saltago put in some damage on the side of, uh, onto Rav on, on screens. Mm -hmm. And after that, all the rest of the three KC players just played everyone separately. So, uh, Mempire's towards hell all isolated all on their own. Oh, 100%. That, and that kill on Statistic was so unlucky for him. Lucky on mm -hmm. Heaven. The second that Solar peaks with that Marshall would have been a guaranteed kill if he didn't, but. That is life. That is Valorant. You do get the unlucky timings, and those rounds do sometimes not go your way. It's how you cover from that. It's so important. The instant timeout called after that bonus lost. And how do you feel about such an early one called? Just the fourth round in. I think it's a good timeout. I think it's a great timeout because, considering by the last map as well, PA is still riding off that momentum from that last map. So they do want to put a stop to that and oh, nice probably come with a strategic plan to get get their first run on the board and possibly more round. Oh, Shiro spams through the smoke any round early. That's not what you see if you're a fan of KC. And no way you find one with the off his own A main on the Lurker where 320 games are taking every time. So it's all up to Saintistic here with the Spectre mid by himself with the spike. Nothing you can do so far as. Four members of PA all crunching down on them, and all I can do is find one in Solar and not much else. Also, do, do KC know that Snowy has an op? I mean, they do now. Three turn games just peeked it with his face and instantly sat down. But, <laughs> oh wow, like, KC loves this 20 mid that. with this. Sky flash with the jet dash in and the nade for vents, but so far hasn't worked once. Hasn't worked once exactly. Shiro getting naded, but getting a like rage away shot onto your app as he was peeking out a ramen. But change of game plays for KC. Four players leaning into this beaming area, but into the hands of Tresenti on the cipher. Oh. We still get a 320 games able to cross the sewers. Here. But I'm not finding much with it. I'm a cage trigger. In one way. Fire in the Ooh, that's a coming out, but. Sorry, get Ooh, one. Get the two! He fucking rockets out Santaco, then takes after Sento as well. And that's the full piece I'm ready for KC. But Snowy finds the Lurker on 320 Five games, planted. not finding much value. And now it's a 3 4 post plant for the side of KC. 3v4 retake without a kill, and they do have an AWP on that retake. Look at Shiro's position. His, oh, what an unlucky Any TP out of Statistic. Not a good map for him. Solar dashes in, getting one, does not get the second. Is out of Shiro, and B main gets these two players back. Sias, yes, the pop flash comes out, does connect, and no swing coming out of it. He knows where both players are. Gets full blinded. Not finding anything yet. No blinds left. One Finds the first one. And Sias lakes the second one as there's a clutch for Shiro. He has time for the bomb and more rounds on the board for PA. Yeah, I'm surprised clutch. that they wouldn't peek after after the first flash. Even after the second flash, they just didn't, would not peek. I mean, they're two people. Even if one peeked, one died, you could have gotten the trade on that kill. Exactly. This both play so scared. They're both. I can't imagine in comms. You're like, yo, don't peek, don't peek. 2v1, 2v1, don't peek, don't peek. But at the end, Shiro. Finds the first one, isolates, and just clean bullets out of him. It, was a, it looks so good for KC, and, and then it just fell apart once again. Yeah, I mean, you, you got him blind twice. Get Fully out blind. of my way! <laughs> exactly. 
but we are on to the next round. This one is another half by three deagles on the side of KC, but they do have the jet knives. A tool they could use when solar with this op. Can't miss any broken down. Three turning right. games, kinda stuck in this corner. Does have a cage to jump across, but no. Those spots. Vickers at the op. Amy okay, ready right. for Rob to make a play. Trying to sit this op down and no! Rob is the one who has to sit down and three turning games gets the hell out of there. Can't find much with that Spectre long range and look at where Casey is setting up. Three players mid again. Where are they so often? Ooh. No, but Fable, what a shot out of him! Brief some hope and Vampire finds one of his own. So the mid exploration is working out for I KC know exactly here. Where you are. One round they didn't have the jet push in. I've got your trail. Yeah, but definitely know the A site has only Just one. Here. <laughs> oh, getting sniped by that nade. A site is free. Oh, Fable's running in. Fable, regrettably so, getting taken down for some time. We're not gonna find another. Getting the cipher off with five HP left. Shiro so far away, even with this bomb is planted. What? Oh. Ooh. What a catch for the cam. Maybe not even breaking my 220 games with that up. Ooh. Maybe it's something down. Didn't matter in it though. It's all up to Sal Taco here. 1v3 1v3 Add yeah. That's secrets in 1 but Honestly Quite possible It may be a save out of her Is he finally putting their Let's first run on the board Looking for exits Having Ooh. money for next round Just find one Ooh no She's gonna die this way Yeah I mean That's not the round I expected KC to Come out in the end Especially Rav going down early to that off, and then I mean their mid exploration finally worked out. They've been trying for like the past three rounds, and that was the one that they found the picks they needed in. Thor is back on the op again. Did get one last round, but he did highlight how Solar fiercely did not like buying this op himself, only using and picking it up. But maybe a change of heart this map, buying it himself, going to the light shields, but. Grab does have an op of his own picked up from last round. So we're playing the more passive vent angle. And now they smoke out here again. Stop clearing out. Grab, not no clothes, but a boom button should. I guess not. Grab, <laughs> it's angle. Things on trip. But not much out of it. Both sides content just to play it slow. Here. Empire, look for a fight. It's Sh Shiro. Hey, Ramp. Does Nothing. find info, backs off. But look at Soli's position, honing this. Oh, he's calling all the rotates over to A as well. Empire dragging so many PA members. Yeah, I don't know what the reason for the call is, but look at that. You can see all the PA players going back to their positions. Yeah, maybe just for a heal onto Shiro. But Sal Taco would be met with surprise. 320 games already walked up as Chica's taken out and Rav with the up ah, first one in and Chicente's left alone on the site. There's gotta be some heroics out of him and oh, first shot does not connect and he connects to second. It's statistic yeah, trading back with standing. two all up to. Solar with his off of his own, and I don't know how much you can do here with well, a heal coming out of Fable for Statistic, grabbing up the rifle. Oh, a blind coming out, maybe a peek as well. I'm gonna play towards the op so that they can save the op later. Oh, 100%. Vampires thinking about a th future. Getting his op, but Solar <laughs> finds the first one. Finds out what the second one is. And oh, what a swing, a dash up, and Vampire cleans out the round, that's the second one for no KC, and no op, it's not to be picked up. I guess Rav didn't want the op anymore? I mean, Maybe he's like, no, valid with the way he's playing, he's kind of dashing in and being the point of the spear for his team, so maybe op is not suited for the needs he, for the, the needs he has. 
but despite having five rounds in a row, those two losses really did hurt PA's economy. And now look at that, just one rifle on the board. Knives is there for solar. But two players on only pistols. Initial spray coming in seconds. This snowy, what's this? Only rifle has oh my god, Shiro runs in. Gets traded out by Statistic though, and Snowy can't find much value. And Rav in this deep a ramp position, Shiro the Stinger holding this close angle. Rav That's might be in for a surprise here, but maybe Shiro is in as well. And no, wait, where is Rav? Lucky upgrade for Shiro, but Cypher 1v1 goes KC's way. That's gonna be an A site plant for KC. Spike planted. Look at Fabo deep with Lurk here. Late re clear of the of T side. It does have to come quickly to sister team here though. It was already out, getting back to the camp. It's gonna be hard for him. And yeah, Spencer smoked by 320 games. So now it's 2v3 exactly and oh the Neurothraft used as well, so even worse case scenario for PA. Maybe they're hoping for some exits here, but looking rough for them. Look at that member of Michael. Oh snowy. Finding a nice one. <laughs> that double jumping onto the other side. Let's find another and finds the third as well. Does lose the rifle in the process, but making a costly round for KC. Gonna see some uh, acrobatics there from the race. Clean satchel. <laughs> and despite all five going down that round for KC, they still do have money for buy, and so does PA as well. well PA did save last round, so that is true. Gonna have money for this round. <laughs> it is a. I you know. I'll. I'll say that's a successful save for the side of yes, PA. Yeah, that was a great save. They, I'm they just got gone. All them down. Yeah. And another lean on this B side for KC. But it is stacked more heavily, leaving Solar by himself on the A side, just playing contact back deep screens. There's no op on both sides here, so a fair mid range combat ish round. That's true. And look at all of. Oh, 300 games! Maybe a legal kill there, but South Taco saves it. Trading him out again, and more pressure mid. Coming out of KC, but Doc finding some rotate some sewers maybe, but no. Ravis left in this deep position. Oh, finding Run. Shiro. And Fire in the hole. Oh, oh my no. god, Vampire getting taken out by Solar. Trying to dash up to heaven to find some more, but no. But Satoko walking out of the smoke, does find a timing. Oh, Statistic does not know. And just take it down as punishment for it. The defuse is coming and Fable's gotta hurry up, but Solar up heaven, shading him out and dashing in. Oh my god! Oh, no, nice Taco try, getting off the bomb, taking out Rav, and that's Don't another round for PA. Vampire more like meme pyre there. <laughs> Lily Rosa thing there. <laughs> Fully blind, satcheling into the omen smoke up heaven. I would say that's a meme pyre play, but yeah, there's some like. Wow, plays there that whole round where 320 games seems like they got quite a legal kill on, I believe it was Cyro and <laughs> Rav trying to save the round there, dashing on Satako, defeating the spike, but just in the nick of time, Satako hops off, gets the headshot, and wins the round out for PA. Does push KC onto a light buy. Just one rifle on the hands of Rav. Hoping for knives next round. Bye. The camera is destroyed. Does Pinkett feel for One off. Just... Yeah. These knives, so. I'm definitely looking for it. The yeah, ideal situation for, would be for, his, for Rap to get a kill and then drop that uh, rifle for someone else on the team. Oh, 100%. But once again, more bed pressure coming out of KC. Love fighting. Both male and vents. No way running this. They saw you thinking it'll be more of an 8 lean. But, Rav, 
make it look like trying to go B fast, but no bridge to call. Will not attempt to push it out one way if that Cypher has. Yeah, 100%. Never want to push out one way Cypher, but... Ooh, Cypher oh. finds the timing, but finds nothing of it. Shiro being on his toes. And the race when we won up a heaven, what he expect? Solar here, holding his exit. He's got a sandwich between the two duelists of PA. That's full you took it. That's the full you took to get out, but oh my god, Solar walking up, constricting. Oh, two players drop. Shara finds the first. Rap trading about, and Snowy getting the hell out of the dodge. And oh, Solar, one be wearing a vampire, does find him in the end, so. The two. Oh my god, Raw finding a third, getting trade out finally by Tresente. So it's all up to say, Testic by himself on this A site. Up against the two KC members, that's almost a signature. Statistic peak now, the TP back. Does not find any info from him. Both members grouped together on the that's T side, walking up. Did you hear the second Does that have paranoia to clear that? No, and yeah. Clean trade out of Tresente. Cleaning up that round and that's seven on board for K uh for PA I should say. Spike the fuse. I mean that looked pretty good for PA, but Rav did pull up some heroes getting three on the entry for that round. Not expecting I was not expecting him to get solar killing the guy heaven then pretty much ninety degree flicking killing the guy A main. I mean they're trying. I'm sure Casey is trying. Was here. They're trying. They did get that. Goes there. Quite a good three game streak within the middle of the sea oh, of blue nice spot. for PA, but yes. you need more than three and a half, but unless you're banking on that 9 3 curse, which I doubt they are. Get out of my way! I don't know, maybe at this point they're like 9 3 curse, guys. Let's just go for it. <laughs> 9 3 curse, let's lose these two rounds. But, so look, yeah. let's find the info. Ralph and I, so it's full buy in. Oh man, such aggressive play. A full retake coming out. Uh, Oh wow! Smoke and a nice the headshot for Rav, but Snowy finds one headshot of his own. So it's a 4v4 retake and Jacenta oh, makes that 3 on the side of KC. And now those all the locations are going. Oh, oh yeah. makes that 2. With 320 games getting pushed up too, looking the, the wrong way, getting showstoppered in 8 rounds for PA. Oh. Eight, mean, four guys, eight four guys, eight four, eight four. Eight four guys. Eight four, nine three. Last round before. Eight four, nine three. I mean, they either win the round or they get the nine three curse. And despite losing that round, despite losing the past three rounds in a row, five's not the worst in the world for KC here. Three rifles, a bulldog. Not sure where three twenty games is leaning for right now, but definitely has some money to spend. If you're, other if hand, you're KC, you you definitely want to get this round. I mean, oh, sure, ninety curse is the whole meme thing, but you want to get some rounds, get that momentum, going to a half with the with the round one in in our side. Oh, I just meant, but another fast really blind, fast the team fly coming out of grab and not fine. What's not gonna do Snowy and Tresente and Snowy holding down this B heaven? And, oh my God, a round's oh. over already. All of KC getting shut down in an instant. And so much for winning that round, Stab. Well, well, I told you they're the 9 3 curse. Plus, split as a map that wouldn't be too much into. It can, it, it's an attacker side of map sometimes, it's a defender side of map. It's, it's a weird map, I'd say split. Split can, it, it, it can be ruined by any of the sides. You can, you can either outclass the team by being on the attacker side or outclass the team by being on the defender side. Oh, 100%. Especially with the comps they have. This double duel is definitely. Strong on the attack side as well as the defender side with the raise utils slowing down pushes and how you see there that nade splitting up all of KC making them take the ones. But here they are playing a normal default with all of PA looking for this garage fight. Rob looking to hit a shot. Ooh, finding the first shot. Not That's connecting to the second, backing off and Zoe so sitting him down, punishing him for looking for more. And this is no cypher site, so they gotta be careful about this one way. Mirror comps oh. have mirror setups. Oh, hip hop, look at Fable. This is not what PA was doing on oh. their side. It's a Fable in the sewer position. Great spot. 
Great spot to find no one, one but not peeked out yet. No one's looking at sewers. No one looking. Yeah, exactly. No one looking at sewers. But if it takes oh. too long, the timing will fade. I, mean, I don't know. Let's see, Destin so finds. Look at this. Destin is pushing, uh, shutting down the push, but Justin's trading him out, weakening up the feet defenses. Oh, oh, now is when he strikes. Oh no, oh, oh, no. oh no, the whips are coming in, but Memphire kind of saves them, getting two of his own, and that is the pistols for KC. We know what we're doing. Trust me. Definitely what they want. Definitely what they want to start the half. Get the pistol. Get the get the buy round, and then if possible, try to come with the bonus, and then you're looking better. Yeah, you got the wheels rolling. You have the momentum going despite being maybe like two rounds down. And oh, this is definitely you... a start. This goes yeah, here. If I didn't want to use the satchel, I'm pretty sure. That goes there. It's fine. Just 200 credits gone. Here. And it's full save out of PA. All five players running mid and ooh, some ooh. damage coming out of Empire. They not connecting in oh, way with Nate. They'll kill. kill somehow. Not sure how that happened. Why the enemy, Cypher? Not but your own. Still going fast. <laughs> Straight into the hands of Fable's Judge. And dolling out the push here. And yeah, it's like easy remaining. cleanup for KC. Unless Snowy's down, got some unbelievable like heroics coming out of her. But it doesn't seem like it. Flawless fourth round out of KC. Hey, Snowy got her kill in that round. <laughs> We got this. Yes. Got, this <laughs> got, got mine, guys. Got Roma. mine. <laughs> I don't, I don't, I'm not really sure how <laughs> Tresente died to that nade. <laughs> oh. I thought that nade was like oh, deep point nice. events, but I guess it bounced off missed and they got Tresente ahead, but that's last round and here are the rifles coming out of the side of PA. And more B side aggression that come with them as well. A deeper flash than usual that you'd see for A main there on his attacker side. So Trump definitely would want to convert if you're down man three, right? Oh, yeah. oh look at Cage Rob is Oh, the one way coming out. Maybe getting two, but just find the one for now and Rav pushed up all the way through A main, already going through sewers. So much info for the side of KC. Look, he's so much better on this defense side. Kills with will be used to get some info towards Wens. Now, Fable again, sitting there with Cage the judge. Track. Another judge coming out blinded. Oh, now no, it's find some damage under Chasente, but not much else other than that. 4 HP on the Cypher. And two plays from events. It's gonna be a battle, and Statistic is the one who wins it out. It's all up to Shiro, and. Jacente stuck in his behind the position and it's all up to the 4 HP Cypher with nothing to do, so that's the bonus you were talking about, Stab. Yeah. Not looking too bad on the side of KC. I told you, Split is that map that even if you're down 9 3, if you're down a few couple of rounds, you can easily come back because Split is that kind of map. Nothing changes on the map, but something just something happens on Split. Oh, 100%. Now that the Miss Daily. Not the op online, maybe it was buy for that, but it's no longer a safe. It's... Five deagles out of PA. It seems like it should be a seven if all things go according to plan for KC. But so if so there's something to say about it. Not expecting yeah, the guy back screen, Lander. but neither no statistic and vampire finding a kill on with the boom bot. Some surprise and it's gonna be a hand down and a rifle. PA You're up the tempo on the side for PA here this time. Oh, Hunchman, look at Jacente. What if a fast look through Benz and two players not looking his direction? Easy picks, finding the first, maybe not finding the second. Ooh, but getting out, so living, but Rob finds one of his own. So it's up to these players on the site, and they can't do anything, and Jacente so far away, that's gonna be easy to fuse for Rav. A good round if you're KC, a good round to win here. Go around here and Jacente kinda needs to die for the money. Maybe bring one with him. Running away. You're just yeah, not letting go. That's exactly the way you want to play that round, yep. Was a save for Sada PA. And they did get two guns. Not the worst in the world. Did get the plant as well. Rav now has an op. 
Yeah, hands. Rav. Rav in the hands of Rav. Rav. See what value he's finding. He's currently leading B here, playing on that pallet box while the rest of PAs all coming A actually. So maybe not that much action this round, but. Again, PA are playing the same shot of upping their tempo than how they're usually playing. Oh, such fast tempo. Runny dashing in. Fighting does not find the first kill actually, and it's up to you, Snowy and Shiro to clean up the mess that Solar made, but in the end, it's still the site for the side of PA, so. So we can take walked up mid all around in wins. Last time did not get that much while you also yeah. got one pick, but then now it has uh, a has a gun, has a rifle. Walking up again. Empire seems unaware, but maybe looking, just reloading. But both oh. cypher is on flanks. And oh what a timing of the smoke. Unlucky. But Three Friday Games finds value of his. Let's see if Presented does that videos. He does, finds the first, does not find the second, it's up to Empire with 36 yeah. HP and the showstopper committed. Oh no! Damage on his own, and Sao Taco cleans him up, and... I would say that's a Sabroza! <laughs> he got blocked by the box. And doing damage to yourself is not a good look, but... That is the showstopper committed, and... Not the round confirmed for KC, so... Not a tool they have for this round. And now... Again, Rav, again buying the AWP. This time Slora also off choosing to buy the AWP as well, so... We're gonna see an op duel here? Op duel be made is definitely possible. Rafi oh, posted yes. up in the pallet once again. What? No, taking more aggressive ankle. Let's get flash. Full flash actually. You have to commit the dash early. He's kinda stuck on a wall. Not able to get out and. Flash once again with the op. Oh, oh that's quite a value. Tiny bit of damage back, but definitely taking that trade in the favor of KC. Look at Fable. Fable might get a pick on Tresenta here in mid. Maybe. But Tresenta playing it safe, hiding by the smoke. Man, <laughs> trying to break that trip right now. But 320 Games is happy to just sit trying. on his cam. I think they're repositioned off now for me, so. Seeker's committed. Getting one value in events, knowing that there's one there. And Kindness is getting stopped in this. Shallow mid position, so not much found. And look at Saintistic, all the way up A, getting so much in for his team. We'll hear the showers rotate, or sewers rotate when that comes in. The three players from KC on this B site, ready to receive the hit. And not much can be found. Ooh, Vampire not finding anything in the curry hold, but three friendly games is, but back steps into the op, so. That's gonna be sight unless Rainbow is able to find South Taco. We need that Sky Five Move one. So it's the three members on the side of KC against the two of PA. Ten, Ten seconds, seconds on the board. Oh, it's Rob. Position. Oh, getting oh. legged. Taken out. And legged. It's all up to Shiro getting taken out as he's trying planning. And that's eight on the board for KC. Are you? I mean, I told you, what a nine game. Three is a thing. Nine three nine curse. Three Plus it's split. It's the most split personality map because you don't, you don't <laughs> have the attacker side of the map or the side of defense side of the map. You don't know. You just don't know. I mean, yeah. And what do you say now that Casey's like in the lead of the? Do they have they have the momentum for sure? Oh, they would do. You have be, to would you favor them in this map now, or do you just have faith in PA to close it out? Well, based on this momentum, if KC is able to just do what they're doing, they win this round. They win this map. I mean, All of the KC who wins this map, win the next map. <laughs> really way. hitting on that five map series, which could really be a possibility as Rap finds the first pick. Cleaning on Solar's knives, taking that down. So, it is the site. Oh, that's statistic. Ooh, finding a timing and Enemy down. maybe getting timing against him himself. As that's the gun for South Taco, she gets an upgrade, and it's gonna be a fast retake. Nice pop! Oh, what a shot coming out of Rav on the Snowy with the knives. It's still taking it out. It's all falling apart for PA as Vampire finds one of his own. It's all up to Tresente pushing around the flank, but they definitely know about this, or do they? And Vampire takes Tresente's head off, and that's nine on the board for KC. 
Definitely nice. looking way closer. I'm telling you, 9 3 curse is a thing. 9 3 curse is a thing now. If you're not feeling good, just get three rounds. Just get three rounds in the half. You, you, the game will help you win. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that was a safe round out of PA. I like to see this timeout coming. Theorize about there. Buy round now, but Tresente. Rough economy. 2,900 credits. Not able to afford a rifle. But what does PA have to change here? Like, what's what's not working? What do they need to do? Well, they were playing slow. Well, they tried fast tempo on their eco, on their eco round. It worked. They got they were able to get plant down, and I think it was a thrifty round on set for for that for them this half. Before that, they were playing really slow. Did not manage to win a single round. Once they've managed to get planned down, they've been trying to do that same push of, of really upping their tempo. I think they need to switch it up a little bit. Uh, they've been doing the same thing that Casey was trying to do, which is running that, was pressuring the mid control there. But I don't think mid has been that effective for them because every time they've been trying to push site, even though they've had one player station towards B main to get that pick on the cypher, they've still fallen down to, that or, to the other Casey players that have been rotating from A site. Yeah, so maybe change in tempo is definitely something what they need. But we are heading into a tech pause out of that tech pause. A common theme throughout the series. The double pauses of one round. It seems like uh, it seems like something's on their Samsung refrigerator, huh? Yeah. <laughs> on their uh... Samsung digital refrigerator. If they're, they're, they're pulling it all stops out for finals, bringing out the Upgrading from the toaster to the refrigerator. Mind you, this is their sub also, by the way. That is <laughs> true. But... It seems like there's a trial. If some of them are playing a trial, we're gonna Valorant. <laughs> no. This is the buy run out of PA. They got some extra time to cook up the strats. The minute was enough. They get the extra tech time out. What do you like to see? What do you think they're gonna cook out of here? They're all stacked up 5B right now. I think people are ready, but no one, but I think they forgot to, <laughs> to resume the timer. There we go. Yeah, then we're all waiting. Okay, 50 seconds, we're ticking down now. And. What, what do you like to see out of PA right here? Would you like to see go fast, put it to Cypher, setting up, or... It I doesn't seem they like they're slowing down take, the tempo at all. They should be able to take B, just be solo B control. They have the util for it. They have the paranoia to get in with B's back. Cypher so those can break the trip if they try can, but then... Uh, oh my god, 3 game is getting taken out back side. What a crucial pick from Snowy and a... So it's not popping as well, and... Shero's the one actually that can cast Intestic, so that's 2-0. Down on the side of KC as Rap going such an aggressive peak. Also gone. So it's two members. Planted. Fable of Empire. The weight of the world on their shoulders to win this post plant. It's power of four on the side of PA. It's all the tackle. Playing real good Fable of Empire. Oh, Tresente. Body Fable, but Empire. Evening up the score is the only three left for PA, but I doubt he's going to find anything. Ooh, what bad timing from Empire. And. I was at timeout. Does seem like the fast pace did help, and Snowy with yeah. some heroics come killing the Cypher Ink Cream backside. Maybe it's a bit of over aggression from him. Yeah, no more of that split push. All five of them just run it down B main. Oh, <laughs> 100%. You got it. I, I, can't, I, I know what's going on at that timeout. Guys, we're throwing. Stop pushing. We just play together B main, and we just kill this dude and win. And I mean, no work. And now they're thinking, if it works at B, why don't it work at A? But, they should be a bit more resistance on this A site. Three members here stacking up A Heaven. And, stall of detail coming out of Empire. As, look at Solar already pushing deep back on his site. And full site control on the side of PA with Fable. Brought down to 1 HP. We've seen Casey win this before with the 5 5 5 5 Yeah, but not with three picks going on the side of PA and 
Fable and Rav bring two of their own. 2v3 and Fable is low HP here. 2v3, but standing. the one way does not go inside. Oh, ooh, Chaos not connecting from Fable, so Shiro getting an easy one there. That's match point match for PA. Reversing that 9 3 curse. Cursing the curse. <laughs> and now we have a timeout. And, uh, timeout on the side of KC this time. Definitely they need this timeout. I mean, yep. they're going on a nice little streak, and then suddenly the timeout comes in, and now P is looking, P is at map point. Oh, 100%. The second you hit map point, you kind of got to call the timeout. Otherwise, you don't really have another opportunity other than right now. I mean, they know what P is going to be doing again. They know they're going to five men just run it down to a site. Oh, 100%. And that leads to the question, how do you answer against that? In your rank games, if five guys are running down a site, you're just losing the site. What do you do to fix you it? You leave the site. Just leave it. <laughs> a 5v5 retake is much more winnable than you trying to solo hold five people pushing onto you. Well, let's see if Casey heeds your advice and plays a more retake-oriented style, especially with Vampire 1 orb off of the Showstopper and tastes like the same as well. To be fair to them, that's what that's what Casey tried to do the last round on ASA. That is it's just true. That all the pigs did go on the side of uh, PA there, though, because they gave up ramp control and ramps just got two picks there. Oh, 100%. Snowy finding two insane picks ramp. Cleaning, cleanly closing out that round four. PA, and it's. Seems to be another split on a side of party animals. Spike left for Robin, three it. exploring mid. South Taco getting, getting uh, the secrets. Yep. Ooh, spam connected on that player. Leaving him with 45 HP. Not much to his name, but this is the side with three members on it, including Cypher, so much more difficult to push onto. Especially that when Rob is first. hitting Five shots down, like that, taking out Sal Taco as well. And 320 games. Ooh, That's getting true. spammed through that smoke, Shiro. Trading out solar, so it brings it down to four. Vampire, dangerously low territory, but One does not matter. Remaining. He finds both players spike vents down, mid. with the spike as well as all up to Shiro, needing to ace clutch this round to close out this map for PA. But get awfully timing by Rav, who takes off his head. And now 12-10. Just some good old hard yeah, didn't go Standing with their strat. They split up victory. this time. Oh. Which have been which which is the few rounds that they, which is the rounds that they've been losing this whole half. They split up and they lose. Now, looking at the eco out of side of PA, 50 creds, 150 creds, 100 creds. While they do have to buy this round, if they do lose, it's not looking good I for got next. Use, okay? It but, is OT time. <laughs> yeah. It is, it will be OT time, but this time, 4 B main. <laughs> Thinking of the thought process, like, yo, we did not throw enough bodies B main. Just keep pushing on. Grav is here, what if the mana to receive it? No up in his hands. Yeah, so, yeah, I would like to see some more Util Throne. That oh, night, night, night. too Sal late. Taco. Right. Yeah, Grav finding an easy pick and now flanking. Oh, oh, oh Snowy! <laughs> Flixing onto Rav's head, punish him for re-peeking it now. It is the site for PA. Four members strong, well... Vampire is still on the A site, running through spawn now. Yeah, we're playing this post plant now. Oh. Do they check Snowy? Oh, oh, they do, but no. They know? Oh, they do know. But Shiro, taking the timing to find three, and finally gets sighted down by Statistic, and Solar trades him out for the third map. Of the series goes PA's way as they lead the series 2 1. And that I was mean, PT's map pick as well. Oh, 100%. I mean, PA's now rolling. I mean, they did stumble a bit in the middle of that map. We did have the fake come back as well. <laughs> but the timeout, the timeout is what, is what PA needed to, to just recollect, just come together and be like, guys. Got oh, 100%. Especially now, like, look at Shiro, top of the board, on smokes. Both maps, this is an ascent. Oh, it's him, near the top. 
which is such a difference from the first map on Haven, where he didn't have the greatest of impacts. And I want to see if he can continue this great performance into map 4, which I believe is Fracture. It is indeed. And speaking of Fracture, we're going to be taking 5 minute break before meeting you on map 4.
Welcome back to Map 4, Fracture between PA Capybaras and Casey Espresso. What a banger game that was last map. How do you feel about it, Snapped? I'm a great fan of PA, guys. <laughs> Party animals crack capybaras. I support you. <laughs> Snapped, the biggest PA fan of the body right now. Also a big fan of early bedtimes. I mean, early to bed, early to rise, right? That is true. But we're all gamers here, so we do not do follow that mantra. We are the 3 a.m. queuing the solar queue, despite the 10-game loss streak. <laughs> and KC wants you to live that lifestyle. They it want us to go to Game 5. Time. They want to win Fracture and actually win the series. If it means us playing at 1 a.m. You're hitting a little too close to home there with the 3 a.m. gaming and losing 10 games. I mean, we do what we play together a lot, so it's probably just us every week. <laughs> but... Why are you throwing my games? <laughs> then what are you throwing my games? That's the real question. No, you're throwing my games. But I do hope for at least a competitive map four. Like we did see on map three. The first two maps were quite like strong for like the winning team. KC looked quite dominant Haven. PA only getting five rounds. Well, PA looked completely polar opposite on Ascend, getting giving only seven rounds to the side of KC. As we're getting some technical difficulties going to Age Select. The man with the toaster is still having issues. So you got more time with us. The Samsung fridge, man. Thank you. It, you gotta upgrade. You gotta update. Get the OS update in. Get get that update in. <laughs> what What's the logistics of playing on a Samsung fridge? It's like pressing the ice maker to go forward, pressing the waters to, like to shoot, and opening the door. To <laughs> <laughs> opening the door to o. <laughs> <laughs> you know. Uh. You know what's the benefit of playing on a Samsung fridge left snapped? You have ice cold water and drinks right then and there for you. Exactly. But I'm not a fan of ice cold water. I'm a fan of G Fuel Soup. And if I'm playing on a fridge, it's right there. Damn. Did you, did you enjoy cold soup? Do you enjoy cold soup? I mean, it's like cold pizza, you know? It's, it's, it's like... Both people oh. in both camps. You can love cold soup. You can also love hot soup. You can love cold pizza. You can also like hot pizza. I've like, never had my pizza cold. You haven't had cold pizza before? No. Oh my god, dude, you're missing out. That like cheap no. co Costco pizza is like 10 bucks for like a whole 18 inch pizza. You leave that shit in your fridge. Man, it's amazing the next day after. So that, you gotta <laughs> try it, man. I think I'm putting you out the cold pizza train as we're still having difficulties because this fridge just refuses to be put into a fracture seems like the fridge is um i think it's not it's not i don't think it's a real samsung you know <laughs> <laughs> maybe it's the off-brand taboo fridge we all got the bats right yep. <laughs> the taboo ads so ten dollar fridges this is what he's playing on <laughs> i mean you gotta do what you gotta do to get to the shiny servers the new shiny server is like so hot right now can we like can we like move to there? I mean, they have amazing skins. They have all <laughs> they have all. Yeah, they have amazing skins. skins. Do you see like the tutorials on their homepage? I have not. Man, they like give you like silver lineups in the homepage of like how to play your agent. Whoa! What? Why don't we get that? <laughs> exactly. Because we made the right. Please. Yeah, we make the lineups for them. Mm-hmm. But we are going to try to get back into Aegis Select. Let's hope his Samson Fridge doesn't conk out on us again. As is third time the charm? Is third time the charm? Maybe third time's the charm. Who knows? Maybe this guy needs to find a new appliance. Maybe there switch we go. it up to the stove. <laughs> As we should be into the Aegis Select. Yes, we are. I wouldn't be surprised if they DC during Aegis Select. As, oh my god, instant breach lock. Not that surprising after 320 games. Moving off of that cipher roll. 
I mean, three twenty games has been popping off. He has been playing quite well on this initiator role. As nothing too surprising coming out of Casey's side. Interessante with the series with long yoru hover baiting me all the yoru. time. The fake yoru, no easy. Interessante, um, lock the yoru right now. Do it, do it now. No, hover no. straight to the cipher. But you heard me. You heard me. That's that's the only thing. Quite normal comps on both sides. It seems like. Ooh, but major a, danger. A Ray's on the side of PA versus the Jet on KC. Which agent do you prefer on this map? Oh, uh, the Rays. I would definitely prefer the Rays. The yeah. Rays is much more acceptable for the strategies that I have cooking for a fracture. Oh. It's actually the nade, A main, with the Choose combo with agent. the breach stun. It's just oh, so yeah. strong. Getting so much free trip damage. Yeah, get the nade, get the brim all right behind so there's no escape. It's over. Oh. GG. What a set play. Maybe leaking strats. No, it's or something a game against that everyone OS. knows. It's something that everyone knows how to do. If they don't, then I'm sorry. Yeah. <laughs> Not just the difference between the Jet and the Rays, but also Cypher versus KJ. I'll say this is definitely a pretty strong Cypher map, but we definitely see that KJ way more because of the strong lockdown in Underpass. Mm-hmm. And with Tano, uh, you do have the Brim... Uh... All to break it. But if you were playing on these teams, what do you prefer to cipher with a KJ? I play the I've played the KJ more on this map, so I would go for the KJ because I know KJ setups. But I've seen some insane cipher setups where they just hide in the corner of a cage. And oh, hundred percent. It's it's all over. Like you try to push them, that the trip always gets you. There's someone always else just holding that trip. Even if you, even if you ask Cipher, is not holding that trip. Someone will always get that kill easily. Yeah, especially so one of the biggest. Yeah, one of the biggest benefits of Cipher is what you just seen right there. Chasente putting a chip north side and just leaving it and not having to worry about the range of your trips like KJ does. So he has trips both side north and south, which KJ doesn't really have. But some early aggression coming out of KC. Hey, main. Not finding much contact though as he gets directly. Oh, to Rob, but just poor aggressive. 320 games is running forward, and now he's trying to hold this aggression as the rest of his team moves over to the B site. And Fable clean what? pick off to oh no, what? Snowy. What did I just see? <laughs> the bullet's <laughs> not connecting, outlining 320 games' his head, and it's all up to these last One two players. And Gyro by himself on the B. side, and not much you can do here because Vampire takes him out. It's a clean pistol round coming from KC. God, are we gonna see? Does this mean we're getting the fifth man? Too early. I mean, really early. Too early to say. Too early to say. That was just Hold your horses. I mean, that's gotta be on first first. It's like great second map or great third map coming out of Snowy at least. Well, I and don't not know. a great start for the floor. 320 games just staring at the wall. <laughs> that is true, also. I don't know where 320 games <laughs> is staring at, but. Apparently, something he's doing was working. The Yoru cosplay is real. <laughs> I mean, we don't have Yoru selective, but we have Yoru in the hearts of the players. Yes. Yeah. It seems to be a simple B split. With both Cypher and Green <gasps> Ooh, contact her. No peek from Empire, though. Yeah, I mean, Thinking off. Oh, what a timing off that stun. Nothing can be found as he's trying to come in. No valley for solar. Killed my bot. And oh, Fable. Last by one of those. Empire with three here now. And Shower on a run, running down underpass, getting choked by Rav as well. Nothing you can do. So, oh my god, Good run, run. run. <laughs> but now, two turning game. Takes him down, and it's easy, flawless for. KC. KC. I mean, good start for KC. Definitely what you want to see after a quite a tough loss on split. Yeah, just there had a fake comeback. Close. Oh, uh, the, the fake comeback definitely feels rough. But now, that's the last map. Now we only care about map. fracture. Oh, 100%. 
as it seems like another split, but coming A the side with oh. self team flash, not finding much from Raph's side. And Tricente oh. walking into his crosshair is yeah. not. Yeah, spot Tricente though. Ooh, but does gonna take it out. Fable finding both. Insane shots coming from him, so. And that's two guns. Two guns going away of KC and. Man, this judge. Such a scary position. This is what you're talking about, but. Ooh, the nade finding Fable up dropping. Shiro not, not checking. No in a second. Solar finding good shots as well. One the fire. Remaining. But Rav on the site. Still posting problems for the side of PA, and that's the bonus converted for PA, or KC, I should say. Wow, KC's looking real good out there. I don't know what happened. Maybe, did they, did they take in some more G Fuel soup, or what happened there? Exactly. What flavor do you think they're taking? I, I'm personally like blueberry G Fuel, but... I don't know, I know there's a bubblegum G Fuel fuel, so maybe... Bubblegum G Fuel. Yeah, I mean... I mean, we gotta get Maddie here. To like get a geofield ranking one of these days, <laughs> but for now, only thing that we can really talk about right now is how, how good KC has been playing these first starting few rounds. Night and day, at least at the start of last. Man, Fable fighting another one through the wall, and just the shots is not connecting as well. Nothing's going well for PA right now, but there's still hope. Eagles do pack quite a punch, but man, look at the rope players. Both KJ and Breach roping across, crunching down on Grim. Oh, where is Oh no! Where is it? Just lucky, but doesn't matter to end. Another ball is coming out of the side of KC. Are I mean, you sure that they don't that that they're not taking a little too much of this G Fuel because. Cause they're looking real good out there. Yeah, yeah, exactly. What did they eat between games? They had, they look strong in the second half split, but oh, it's something like this. From the fridge to a PC now? What's going on? Uh, maybe. <laughs> maybe and... they brought the team morale up. But look at this Rav going on the op now. Smoke's down. I want to go meeting three players. Definitely. Oh, the shots not connecting actually, but ooh, more not connecting. Coming out of Rav and Ooh, I pushed off this aggressive oh, <laughs> angle. But nothing slows down PA's game plan. And yeah, look at your have the lockdown as well to retake A site. Oh, I was about to highlight tactics. the sky boom one on the north side of the map going Fable's way. Now what you like to see if you're a PA member. Look at Solar. No. Could get a pick on 320 games here. Ooh, but Smart system right. spot, getting the info without taking any damage, and seems like Casey did stack the wrong site, but if it was correct, they ever running over to B now, as they understand a hit is coming with the smoke yeah. down. Yeah. Oh, the O coming down, but oh, it looks like Solo wasn't ready for it, but Tricente was. Oh, but with it's that ill used, that lockdown could be dangerous. The lockdown oh, could be dangerous. We gotta look at Empire if he falls early, the uh, lockdown could be exactly wasted, but. Does not. Seems like trying to pop it, but doesn't go down just yet. And I think that's where the ult comes in now. At that position, yep. Yep. Charlie oh, coming in. There is a pocket for Tristan to play in, but both no, no, Solar no. and Shiro pushed off site. But uh, unless Shiro can find some pocket of his own, it's gonna be a rough here, but ooh! Grab shots not just connecting and Shiro cleaning up Empire and Solar finding the pocket. I mean that's the round for PA. They didn't need a Brimol. They didn't need it. Yeah, don't need it. They just win their ones. They just they just, they just stay out of the side and then they just win it. But left that four round win streak. Casey's eco is blossoming right now, and despite Rav's Minimal success versus op is having it in his hands again. And But it seems like PA is leaning on the opposite side of the map. Not gonna be peeking into Raps operated here. Oh, oh, snowy. snowy. Finding the first one. Sands leaving Vampire all by himself. But does have to catch you to on site. Bot going down first, and both volleys still up. Not popped yet. 
waiting for him to see when he does pop Bomb it. And there it goes. But full sight, full PA. Yes, yeah, South Taco going a bit too aggressive. Statistic punishes. They do have the Rolling Thunder to retake as well, so. 100%, but Showstopper on the other side as well. But look at the, the KC members, two on the flank. And PA has nowhere to oh. know better. But it's entering a bit. This off is oh, not finding yeah. value. And Shiro clears out both players' A main. It's all up to Statistic. Duck. In this post play situation where it's kind of impossible against the ops. No, he cleans them up. That's two in a row for PA. Okay. The the first three rounds was the KC hype chain. Now it's been derailed a bit. PA is definitely looking for competitive now. Hmm. I mean, since I'm supporting PA. <laughs> well done, well done for PA, but to be honest, KC does need this map if they wanna if they wanna win the series. They have to win this map, push it to map five, and then play one map five. But. Oh, 100 percent And you're in a case of PA and going to bed early. I'm in a I'm in a case of supporting. I hope both teams have fun. And I hope we get banger games. But you definitely look like as Spike down. Eagle Attack coming out of Fable and grabs rifle does find value pushing all the way out of a main finding one on Shiro in his own spawn As the rest of the PA doesn't have much to answer because they can push into this Keisha util Falling pushing it straight into the stinger of Empire and Easy upgrade and nothing found except for Solar find a trade in the end and oh the Brimble comes out not much Solar can do Sao Taco getting pinched from behind a Rav, and there it is, 4KC. Gun here. GG go next. It's over. GG go next. It's over. Yes, we're having map five. I'm convinced. Seven rounds in. You already have no faith. Yeah, it's. Uh, I'm convinced. KC's looking completely different out there, by the way. They are playing really well right now. Oh, they're cooking definitely. But if you saw in split. PA had a similar start to this, where it was 9-3 first half, and KC definitely brought it back second half to make it at least a competitive map despite losing an end. I would, I would like to see something similar coming out of PA. As Ron comes through, getting the info, and oh, P gets four members getting the hell out of Dodge. These Eagles not getting much damage onto Rav, but... No, he does have a show, showstopper here, so... Ooh, not funny thing. F Fable fade away. Taking Snowy's head off. Now it's four members still dish for PA. Slowly walking up for these deals. During A main, they know all the aggression that has to come would be coming from dish. So there's no no split coming in on the A side. Oh, 100. They're ready for these dish players to drop. Look at the turning games ready. Aftershock clearing out bot site, making sure they're still up there. And the stun definitely connecting with a few members at least. And oh, it's sent dropping, and no man's land, nowhere to play. And Rav gets two, and finally gets shut down by Shiro. But more shots aren't connecting from him. Spike down A. And Empire oh, jumps up, easy kill for him. Fully blind. Oh, 100. Legally blind. Six rounds. KC side. What a half start. Fiery start. Fiery start, but four ults are on the side of PA. They do have the tools to win this round, especially since that was their save and this is their buy now. I'm surprised they haven't mentioned that social shop, but that show starter has been active for about three to four rounds. Oh no, is this, is this gonna be a repeat of advanced finals? It was not finals, advanced semifinals, the finals of Advanced Saturday. semifinals. But Raph, oh, finding value. <laughs> Gets no immediately, so showstopper, you're up for next round. Oh, rap dashing the wrong direction into I the more members exactly of PA, and maybe you know, South Taco credit that peak also it takes some damage, out. backs off, they've taken the rope and out, but all the B side easy for PA and Statistic. Spike That's one to answer through through retake. Yeah. Oh, Solar and gonna clear it. Retake, are they ready? And Solar is. Now it's all up to Fable and 320. And Solar, same spot as last time. Last Does find a damage, standing. but not finding the value. 
Take it out the end. Yeah, 1v2 with low HP. If you have to isolate all these fights and then just one tap them. If you oh, want to. 100%, but. See? No idea where yeah, Sataku is getting the free kill on him. And that's three on the board for PA. And at least a respectable few rounds so far. Yeah, they're going for the 9 3 curse, right? Oh, I understand. They're... So now they give the three rounds to KC. <laughs> Maybe they won't be giving it so freely, but they'll definitely be happy for at least three on the board, which is similar to what KC had last game. And they, they had a want to be test. going for the next three rounds as well. Definitely trying to tie the half at 6-6. Six, six. Oh, 100%. And Rav, another op. Here. Looking for aggressive peek through doors. He does get flash. Not funny. Trust not connecting. Missing that one. And needing to dash up to side with Shofar are finally used, maybe not the greatest satchel movement, but it doesn't matter as Snowy makes their way into spawn. Look at three members getting two of them. Oh, Rav running straight into it. Another nade online, and that's the bomb down for PAS. Solar finds one of his own, and three target games on his heels trying to trade them out. Not sustaining any damage. Snowy looking for more with a flash coming out, and three blinded games making it a 4v2, 3v2. That's that doesn't the to get it out. Just had the Brimble to get rid of it. Last but, player oh, standing. three turn of games, doesn't find anything with the doors question. He did his Vampire. Lockdown committed. So, that's the, something they don't have for this round. And, timely pause for... A KC timeout coming out. Definitely one that they were... They need, they definitely need one to stop that two round momentum that uh, PA has right now. Oh, 100%. When the, what's the 4 we start? PA is brought, bringing it back to a 6-4 half so far, and definitely solid for them. If they win this round, they're pushing uh, KC onto that uh, eco next, and that's definitely a 6 6 tied half, which is way more than you can ask for when you start 0-4, losing that 4th round. But what... Do you want to see changed out of KC now after their... Do you like to see more of the same? I feel like Rav on that op hasn't been finding the most value in the world, so I would definitely like to see him. Can't afford it off this round, but at least on a rifle or something. How about you? I mean, I've, I mean, if you're looking at their split maps, the rounds that uh, PA have won, they, those are the rounds where they just pushed all five together on site. That's similar to what they're doing on Fracture as well. They're, they're all five together pushing onto site. Uh, Due to and Casey's unable to contain that push, and with this being a larger map, they have to hold much more angles. Oh, 100 percent. Four areas where the attackers can just run on the site from, and Rav switches as judge with the knives. Will be quite poor next round, not having that available. It's just a t it's a lurk here. Some. Pressure B has 320 games in the box spot. Ooh. For hellfire. It's oh, stuck around the box, on. not known, but not caught by the Brimble, but taken down by Tresente, nonetheless. So, all up to Tresente and Sentistic stuck behind the spammable box. And Rav and Fable Spike finds down. value on the two flanks. These Spikes knives me. taking down this planter, so spikes down and open with. PA stuck on site. No, it's a, it's a, a fight it's a standoff. On side. A standoff. This is Casey members just holding these PA members hostage on this B site, not letting them leave, needing them to fight. fight but he's self stunned. The team stunned. Does get so he's taking out of Rash Judge, jumping in. Takes out another, so it's all up to Sao Taco. By her lonesome and Rav finding three with that judge. Closes out this round at least for KC. Round in the half. Don't save anything. I mean, winning round for winning half for KC at least. So definitely at least happy with that. Especially because if they lost that, their buy would have been rough. But I feel like the Achilles heel of that round is no more charges left. Maybe not having a trip, but even if he did have a trip, not being 
prepared enough to fight sure? the I saw that trip getting triggered when Tristante was fighting the 320 games in arcade. Yeah, but just not being ready for that fast flank that KC usually loves to play as 5 man barreling down A main again. Yeah, okay, I mean, that's how he has been winning the rounds. I wouldn't change it either. Oh, 100%, but the Rolling Thunder doesn't find any value, so it's a free site given to PA. It's 5v5 free take. No ults on either side to speak of, and shoot, we're getting spammed in the smoke, and it's out with Taco not checking that corner. It's all falling apart for PA as Raven dashes up top, gets traded out finally one without foot. I'm going out the one, Fable. Cleaning up the round, it's 8 4 half on the side of PC. Well, we know how 8 4 has it been this series. That is First true. map, Casey was 8 4, they won the map. Second map, he was 8 4, they won the map. Third, third map, 9 3, close enough, still on the map. But these maps have. Why have like similarly dominant first halves where one team just looks quite Way solidly better. A better than the other? But. I'd like to see if PA could kind of bring it back like KC did in the third map or they're just kind of like roll over like they did in the first. I mean if but, KC just here. do what they did first map, we're going, for, we're going to the fifth map. Oh 100%. <laughs> but it's a die situation for KC here. Oh yeah, but four guys they main with four on the side of PA as well. Both stuns coming out. Oh, Rav, Fast oh, dash coming out of Rav. But was caught by the stun. Here. Here door, but it seems like they're faking pressure as you know, letting Vampire walk up arcade, getting so much space for their team. But Cypher is here having the camera, getting the info, and calling the rotates over as ready as they know four members of KC are ready to push through this B main area. And Shiro. Playing off the strip, ready for the walkout as we train game. Yeah, trying to try his luck, but nothing can be found. Oh, look and at they're this all table. rotating it's back A. Back. Oh, and Snowy and, rotating back. Oh, and PA that. knows as well. Oh no, <laughs> beautiful. That's what that's what fact is all about. I mean, you can just rotate. Oh, I'm just gonna rotate. So oh, hundred percent. And but the blind gets so much info. Shiro and Solo coming as well as Zao Taco finds the first blood in Sands, but will they expect Rob and at least Solar does not and Shiro doesn't either. So it's four kills going to the side of KC as all of the Zao Taco up in tower by herself to find some value, but nothing can be found. It's Fable closing out this round for KC. I mean we get a pick, we move in. Four kills is with the KC instantly in the blink of a eye. All of PA is just dead. Thing is, Joer. I told you. It's jo uh, Joer, I, I guess. Joer. First round, I told you it's Joer. Here. I mean, I guess you're a prophet. Here. I wish but I was a prophet. I would have ended this game in three maps. <laughs> <laughs> no, but I'm here for a fun game. <laughs> we definitely have some fun games here. And similar yeah. Phantom buy, always with one, one yeah. rifle coming out of Oh, but it's a full out oh, fight coming out of Oh, the 360 oh, come out of your Rob, taking out Snowy, but. No, he's classic. This seems better. Getting four headshots in a row, taking down two KC members, forcing the rest of KC to run towards that B site with the tails towed between their legs. And now that's two rifles, at least, or two guns in the hands of BA. It's such a winnable round now for them. And it's the inevitable judge as well. That's Placing that's with him to PA. Oh, 100 percent. It seems like Rob. It's about to be styling on PA, but now he said no, getting kill on him and another follow up too as well. But there are only two classics as well. And this judge walking through the smoke could find the timing. Oh, oh no! Connecting, getting the bullets, but Tristante <laughs> is and so is Tristan getting a double kill right here and Solar's chasing after trying to find some value. But Empire's good with the trade. Saving this Phantom for next round, but four dead on the side of KC definitely hurts for this bonus. They managed to save the Phantom though, but again, great eco for PA there. Bro, I feel like that's so tragic coming out of 
Snowy like getting those two amazing first kills and not being able to find the third onto. I believe it was 320, so. That's what. That's why the judge is, ba is a bad weapon. Oh, get it no, out of don't the game. say that. Don't get it out that. of the game. Get the shotguns out of the game. Must be a frustrating round for PA, though. So, not expect to win that round at the start, but making it so winnable and just it falling through your fingers at the end. But now onto this round where they do have five rifles compared to the one of KC. And look at Snowy exploring. Not making contact with Bookfire yet. There's no character no either, called either to give of a uh, KG's position. No, oh. so no. Oh, what the timing here? Well, Vampire looking the wrong direction and Oh, oh Snowy's no, bullets here. not connecting. We'll let Vampire live another day. But look at Saltaco immediately off of that coming down. Oh, 100%. Gyro that. as well. But Shataco looking underpass. Maybe not yeah. expecting Vampire into position, but because not switching over. Missing. Oh, but yeah. this oh, is does bad. get a dog. And Vampire <laughs> does <laughs> find some damage down and. Snowy pushing all the way through Dish and Saltaco's bullets not connecting, so Ghost does triumph now and Vampire wanting the second kill. And man, this guy is just a bullet anti magnet dodging all these Vandals and Phantoms, but Last player standing. they're still overpowered to end with Solar feet. and Syro taking out the players on the side. All up to Vampire of 18 HP finds the first three the on the round here, but he needs two more and Ace with 10 seconds left. I don't believe it's possible. And yes, Tracente takes his that's head off, and that's the round for PA. But if you think I about mean, it, Casey were he had one same right foot, I'm pretty sure. Oh, 100%. Three guns down for PA, and now they're forced to get a stinger. And Solar is looking rough too, getting light shields. Yeah. I mean, I'll be pretty happy with that, KC. Especially with the lead I have on this map. This goes here. Yes, this should be. Oh, this is a nice spot. This goes here. But now, it seems like another beast, but coming on the side of KC. Both initiators playing on the side as well. Shiro coming to post up to two pins. Oh, spray does. Spray gets nothing but does damage. That's nothing but 320 games with 10 HP there. Deeping that. Run. Guy here to get it back to at least 100, but look at the north side of the map. Snowy taking contact with two different Solar team members as Solar on the other direction, finding one of his own, but getting oh. the chain in the end, which is so unfortunate for him. So Rav cleans him up. But both Snowy and Tracente pushing on the north side, trying to clamp down on Rav's position as they're playing this 4v4 retake, knowing he's insane, and he's knowing he's 1 HP. Somehow actually dodging the bullets, but in the end, it doesn't matter. But 320 Games finds one of his own getting traded out instantly by Shiro. <laughs> well, it's not connecting yet. And up to Shiro because Vampire finds a clean kill up in oh, tower and Shiro doesn't expect this. You tried. So it is a round one for KC despite it looking shaking throughout the middle. Not gonna lie, I would have gone for the knife at the end there. Oh, 100%. <laughs> but when in the mentality, it's a do or die. You gotta win this map. I don't blame him for taking the kill. But if you do it, that's such a mental diff. It's cause, it's cause, it's cause of my name. I have to do it. Oh, 100 it's it. Stab you death? To, if yeah, you're I not dying people all the time, you know? I have to go for the life kills, I'm sorry. In fact, if I were to, actually, I'll come later to that part. <laughs> I got this fight. having quite a game for himself, 21 and 7, a 3 KD. So much value. I dropped the spike. And confidence, especially that va uh viral buy on that bonus. And you have oh, confidence as well. There's 1v1 Snowy who's been pushing under this dish every round, learning his habits. So Rav does have the knives online now. And that is another player down for the side of PA, another for exposed loss, so looking rough for South Taco, looking at the floor and Despair because she's by all herself. Five members slowly closing in on her, like sharks smelling blood in the water, knowing that she's not long for this world. Swarm grenade. Swarm grenade out. But stunned yeah, now. Oh, that flash should give her that position. Flash and a dog, and yeah, Sal Taco instantly taking it out on the push. Classic, nothing to do about it. 
five alive and oh my god, Rob Rav, is just looking for more three in this round and Spike maybe planted. a fourth. I saw he's peeking out tower. Definitely potential for eight over here. But no, still on the top. But oh, Crescente on a fourth looking tower. And that is the eight for Rav. He put them on that point and that four for KC. Match point. Uh, I, I told you it was Joel round one. Joel. <laughs> I mean, Prophet Stab over here, but man, what a confidence booster. After losing map three in such a close faction, getting the ace, especially. This Good map point, yep. Fills me with adrenaline, especially going to map five, but this is the deciding one. And mind you, this is PA's map pick. Oh yeah, especially because it's PS math equipment and we're going to Pearl. And we don't have much data on either team as Pearl, so it's definitely gonna be something new for both of us. But now it's another 1v1. It's now we're in this disposition. Keeps losing out, but still only starting the map. Rich play here. The rest of KC looking to walk up B main, but nothing found. Well it's not connecting to the traps either, so they stay up. Already starting the round for five. But both teams have three alts online though. Well, Fable just got just picked up the orb and now they're four alts. Oh yeah, Solar. Oh, the top position, taking oh. Fable's head off. So that's one even up four v four. As three more members are also crunching the aiming position. Rav, look at that. Oh, the whole jet lurk. Off your feet. It's such a great position as the vampire jumps down. Tristante's running through and South Taco can do nothing with the judge, but. Sai is still strong at Tresente and Shira holding this down. It's all up to Statistic and Sans with the orbital strike online in the last round. 30 but seconds left. This right position gets attack know? damage and does not win out the gunfight, so it's, it's more life for PA. Surviving for another round. Surviving once again. But how much of this is just the Nada? Delaying the inevitable. It's I know. I mean, six game deficit right now, or six round deficit, I should say. It's gonna be a tough bound to climb, but first round win is a start. It, anyone can do it. Oh, this, oh this 100%. Here. But I mean, the first round is there. They do have full buys, they have four ults there. Orbital Strike, Showstopper, all online, so. Blinded. Snowy, <laughs> looking for a more addition decryption, not, not learning her lesson. But this time not pushing though, so just standing in position. More passive. Just use the boom bar. In KC after losing a round, definitely slowing down the pace. Oh, the spam almost connecting and Oh, he now getting some backups of solar with the breach flash pushing out here now. Putting Fable on a run. So. Look at Shara Sorte knowing we're out of dish, so they have to be on the B side of the map, but Oh no, this could be deadly. Coming back in. Look at Fable. At least one pick here, right? Corner. This one. Oh, oh no, the gun gun gun. Oh no, it's the gun. Gets taken <laughs> out, but Rap finds two on site. That's the whole B side fallen. It's all up to these rotating A players. And Rav looking for more, he's dashing into CT, maybe incredibly slow. But oh, Shira yeah. takes him down, so maybe a bit of overcooked. Has the orbital strike, has the fast retake, a full blind and nothing oh. Vampire can do. Solar finding two up towers, though it's all up to Statistic of an orbital strike oh, of his oh, own, God. playing this post plant position. Shara running in, taking his head off, so well, four well. rounds in the hands of PA, delaying the inevitable once again. Hey, I'm more than happy for PA winning these rounds. <laughs> You're more than happy, but. As this is a fake comeback, that means in the end, we're gonna have to go to bed even later than thought. No, if, if they close it out right here, I'll be glad. <laughs> <laughs> okay, but the question has to be asked. It's 12 7 right now. 5 deficit is quite large, but after this round, as they do lose it, they're on the eco. It'll be rough for them. When do you start believing the PA copium? Right now, why not? <laughs> right <laughs> now? <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm You're now five? Okay. 
yeah, twelve from twelve five. I mean, you don't have to go. You don't have to think about it as a five round deficit. No, you just go round by round. Try to win the round at hand at the moment. In this round, I see two member Stitch with Rav falling already, and Vampire does as well. Snowy falling due for some wins in the Stitch area, finding two. And man, looking rough as Solo. Oh, no, find the information. Spam. That kind of thing. And, oh, oh, gets out. Oh my God, Solar one. 320 as well, both breaches one shot as Fable finds and wins Sky 1v1 B side, but Tresente also here as well. Will he know? Looks like he does. Look at Snowy. Still KT member Snowy here three. early in Tresente. Such a strong position. Up heaven already. Oh. Both trips clear though, so definitely something for. Oh look! They see it. Oh, running all the game. way back A. All the way back and up. Oh, Solar aware. knows now. Well, he is 73, so really easy to see. Calling team over. Shiro as well. Running tower, ready to. Corey, Solar in this A side hold, and Flash comes out, and three members already here. As the... so as the day, so the plan is delayed. 20 seconds on board, and the plan is coming down. So we're gonna be a 3v2 retake. Do we have the show stop here? Oh, as, oh my there god, Solar, based on that Astro Shot, can you take it down? Evening up the numbers. But Showstopper is available for Snowy here. Door out, Shiro oh, versus Fable. This is there such comes a good one a main. As Shiro wins it out, so they do have the flank coming out, but Snowy trades it out, so it's a brim movie one. Saintistic versus Shiro, Saintistic's looking the wrong way, and Shiro clutches it out for 8 for PA. What a I mean, round. I mean, it, it could have gone bo either way. Oh, hundred percent. But PA hope you. I, I told mean, you, I've been doing them since all five. Oh, eight four, actually, actually. Eight four. yeah, to eight four. Even before the map came, I was like, PA wins. <laughs> <laughs> Casey taking a timeout. Just, just. Recollecting themselves to just win that one round so they can go to the fifth map and hopefully win the fifth map to win the championship. That's definitely what Casey wants right now, but what's she time out? Three in a row now for PA, so momentum might be swinging back in a favor, but like you said, Casey just needs that one round, but they're all on to save this round currently. Two Stingers currently in the Inventory is a vampire in 320. Rab with the rifle question, though, and knives ready, so maybe clicking up something there. I, I have a question for you. Do you think we'll see attack after this? We'll see a tech <laughs> pause after this. Yeah, tech pause. Hmm. <laughs> hey, maybe, maybe, maybe the guy's like, yo, yo, statistic. Uh, try on plucking your PC real quick. <laughs> but I told you, statistic switched over to a PC, I'm guessing, from that Samsung fridge, so. Uh, that we is true, but after that, <laughs> after the two, right before the map started. Oh, hundred percent. But man, I feel like as it's paying a comeback right now, not much has changed in the losses versus the wins because Watch Snowy's still peaking this dish, and the only difference is they are winning it now instead of like getting losing it before. This time they have four people stationed to <laughs> Two was it enough last round? We're bringing four. Plus the stun. And now, definitely not able to hold the item all of KC, but... Does get a tiny bit of chip damage on Raph, but not much, so... Oh my god, look at... So Taco and Tresenter running on the other side. They're fighting both sides. This is maybe the round that KC needed. Where PA is bringing the fight to them as three go down instantly. Oh you wouldn't expect the Eco to be the win for KC, but it might just be here as Solar and Shiro are left by themselves as A site as all of KC is going on to be. Phil is being used to clear out its spawn at the moment. Oh, it's Rav looking for more and Solar. Seems to be aware. It's not fine, but no. Ooh, wins out the 1v1. That is the first step. Has the Rolling Thunder afterwards. Shiro doesn't have the overworld fight, so... Just the there it comes the lockdown, just to secure the round even better. Oh, 100%. Now they gotta go fast on the timer as... 320 games get taken out. Oh, but... Nothing. Oh, no. Fable cleaning up. Win. But yet so far away. And that's gonna be... Going to... 
five, game five between KC and PA. Oh my god. What a banger. Indeed, I mean, indeed. Great Look game at that. all around. Six first bloods for that game. That was on something. I, I'm not gonna lie, I thought Shara was about to clutch up that last round, getting that second kill onto Saintistic, but in the end, it doesn't matter. But so we are going to a map five, which is going to be Pearl. How do you feel about that map right now, Stabbed? I like Pearl. I like it. It's a good map. You like it's Pearl? Cool. Yeah, I like map. I like Pearl. I I'm still confident we're gonna see a B. We're gonna see B city. It's gonna be people are gonna hit the B side every single time. Let's see if you're right. But for now, we're gonna take a five minute break before map five, the deciding map between who's gonna be our masters champion. You wouldn't want to miss it. We're going to a five minute break. <laughs> Got no service in a white hood. I don't fuck with the Ku Klux. Old girl got mad and she switched up. So I went ahead, got me a new one. Down bad, so I had to move up. Old one like, hey, what you doing? CA plates in different states. Okay, she like how I'm moving. Step to a bag, better get with the movement. When I move, you move like that. Do more, get more, say less. So follow, don't miss no step. Speed up, now catch your breath. Good vibe, good drink, no stress. Out of town, no GPS. In the hills, can't call, can't text. In the hills, I ain't got no service. Too high up, I don't think I heard you. Head high with the birds be chirping. Going full speed in the freeway, swerving. Got no service, too high up, I don't think I heard you Head high with a bird, be chirping Going for speed and the freeway swerving Swerving But I can't pick up Locked in, my mind's encrypted I secure the bag like lockbox In my zone, I can't hear much I'm flex, I just finesse Make more wanna come around less Out the way where I'm too next Out of time, can't call, can't text In the hills, I ain't got no service Too high up, I don't think I heard you Head high with the birds be chirping Going full speed in the freeway, swerving Got no service, too high up, I don't think I heard you. Head high with a bird, be chirping, going for speed in the freeway, swerving. Swerving.
take it slow Your love, I overdose We got all night to lose control Do what we want Yeah, we can do this to the dawn Welcome back to the banger series between PA versus KC. It just seems like these two orgs just keep wanting to give us amazing five game series. First in Elite, now in Masters, and we're going on to Pearl as our final map. How do you feel about that, Stab? Pearl, I said, I told you, it's going to be a B side simulator. Although, I do have a question. If you remember quite at the start of the stream, you said that PA was. Was, uh, oh, I was did say that. A lot of Pearl. Um, even though they have no maps played on Pearl, they were screaming a lot. And you said that there's something that we should look forward to. There is, but the player that was cooking is currently subbed out right now, so I don't it's know. It's Becky. No. It's Becky. But Tricenta's in. I don't know what Tricenta will play, but I hope it's something spicy. And both these teams have not played much Pearl. One game combined for these both teams on Pearl, so it is it's gonna be good surprise for both of us. It is good to know that even though both the teams have subs in, it's still a great series to watch out for. That is true. Not gonna lie, I can barely tell these both teams have subs right now because they're playing pretty well. They're playing pretty cohesive. All they're peeking off each other, and it's just been such an exciting series that. It's so hard to not get lost in the sauce. It's so back and forth. And since yeah, it's lost. been... <laughs> if, if you look at the pattern right now, KC won the first map, PA wants the second, and PA wins PA again, wins KC wins the second, so... Who will win this map? I don't know the pattern, but we are getting into agent select here. I do, I, I'm just happy knowing that this is the last map. Series. <laughs> <laughs> just happy. <laughs> <laughs> it's a bit lazy for me, Stab. It's only 12 a.m. What do you mean? I work tomorrow morning. <laughs> what, what do you mean, Stab? It's only 12 a.m. You don't love waking up at 7 hours later? But the comps here, two really fast locks coming out of KC, and so do PA. Look, I sleep better, and then I that means I perform better the next day. I mean, that is true, but you got finals are on Saturday, so you got time to rest up. Yeah, yeah. I got scrims to play, man. <laughs> you got scrims. Scrims don't matter. <laughs> they do for us. Scrims Maybe don't not matter. For you. Maybe if they yeah. matter, you'd oh, be well, playing <laughs> here. <laughs> but, looking at the comps here, PA still playing the Viper comp, and it seems to be a standard thing, but one thing to know is no Sky, which is usually the solo initiator. Of choice. Yeah, they're going the... Um, what's the team? Sentinels comp, is it not? I believe the Sentinels comp also had a Silva as well instead of the Viper. Choose oh. your agent. But I'm otherwise, Viper, yeah. other than that, it is quite similar. Well, on KC side, it's basic comp, one smoke. Viper kind of fell out of fashion in the updates, but many teams still play it. Just slight quirks on both sides, but... Overall, nothing too drastic. And no Yoru tech as well. Techie, not here. <laughs> look at this. Oh, good comps on either sides. Good Just comps on both sides. And as you say, I've stuck a Kalim PA here. Better for the B City simulator, you know? That what you've been saying. It's mm -hmm. only B. Maybe the Viper Mollies will bring more value than the Sky Flashes. I mean, they definitely have more post plan util on the side of PA than for uh, KC here. Oh, 100%. I'm, I'm really curious on how they utilize this Viper Wall. Because that's their biggest tool they have that KC doesn't. Where KC has so much more info with the dog and the flashes and the heal as well. Like, as I said before, it's so underrated. I feel like it's such a strong tool to use, but... I want to see how Sawataco plays this Viper. Currently walling off three yeah, different choke points already. Normally when you're preparing for a team, you do some homework. There is no home there is no tape or there's no footage on PA's uh, part. So you don't know what to expect. Oh yeah, Casey as well. 
neither of the team has to said before, like, play Pearl at all, as Knife comes in, and three players all running away from B. But, Soli is running behind us. Oh, three. On the side of KC, running through B link. Into the hands of Sao Taco, knowing that her life is a danger now, as while they all three get one before getting taken down. down and, Crescente, also running for his life right now. On this A site, getting crushed from both ends, but. Out. That is KC's a push. Move. It's stalled out for now, but. Pushed and reckless not connecting, finding no damage at all either. So it's gonna be Ooh. a retake coming on the side that of hurt. PA. Color coming in playing. Perfectly Spike timed planted. hurt here, and Shiro getting taken as well, leaving it to two before. Really rough situation as I'm fired, turning around. No way he's well, not connecting, getting stuck in this corner. And clean pistol round four, KC. Look, I said it last time, round one, when I said Jover, it was KC's when I knew it. That round didn't look so clean. I'm not so sure about KC winning this overall. Not, not, sure, not, yet. Yet. not sure yet. There is. There's just a few key moments where Snowy's bullets didn't connect, and Tresente's right click is a swift, and if those got the bullet hits they needed, then that could have been a really different looking round as five members of KC. Bulldogs, Guardian Phantom, way heavier buys than usual this time. Roiling down B. Just like you said, B City here. It all this is gonna be B City. What? Oh, oh, what a oh, shock oh. up in a Rob sitting down the other jet, clearing out the mirror matchup and the just speeding yeah, up now, dashing over across, maybe finding another, but does get the flash in? Snowy finding one, but Statistic doing one better, getting two himself. And so Taco with a clean shot with classic of her own. And Statistic was worn around with wanting five, but Jacente says no. Down, B. Giving some life for PA maybe, but still classic in a 1v2, so not much they can do here. And ooh. Playing patient for Jacente. Oh! Uh, that right click Looking was... close there. That was scary. Oh, that yeah, right click. That's value right click. My, cla my classic don't do that. <laughs> no one's classic does that. <laughs> <laughs> right no. click double headshot. Two different guys, but in the end, it's still solid round for KC. But the investments were heavy into that one. A phantom, three bulldogs, and a guardian. Yeah, They're I'm still not sure yet. At least. It did not look like how they played Fracture first round, so I'm not entirely sure about Casey winning this yet, because my own prediction could, could swing both ways. Oh, 100% it could swing both ways. It's only the second round in, but Casey looking to be more aggressive mid. Getting contact with the turret as Viper's like by all these already. Yeah. Man, a lot of art presence here. PA just letting them take it. But well, KJ and go wait out the mana spell and then come to that. But look at this connector space they have. They have so much freedom. As South Taco stuck in such a hard position, finding one, swing out for a oh, second, just get a second. But Statistic Seagull able to find one of himself. So it's ending up to be a two v two with guns on the side of KC. So it definitely looks scary for the PA members. Two v two. Rifles on both sides, but Vampire is oh, slow. That molly will not be used for post plan. <laughs> One Why of the nine songs is not gonna be used. But both players playing long. This is my looking like Oprah right now. Just go along and just play post plan. It's so hard to. I told you, B Simulator is just it's just what you do. <laughs> Shiro is playing the. Smoke's character, so he does have. Well, smoke's still available. Placing sentry. First molly pop, second molly pop as well. So time is ticking down for PA. So they're definitely in a hurry to get on this bomb. Things are also coming on. The side. Things come down. First one goes down. Smoke drops at the worst time possible. Both kills goes to KC's way. As that's three rounds for KC. Don't die with the No, no, he's good. I mean, another bonus round going on the side of KC. Looking like last map now. Maybe slightly less clean, but 
No, I'm still not entirely sure. I still think PA can come come back from this. I don't know. On the fracture first, the first round itself made me tell that KC was gonna win that map. Not so. I'm. I haven't gotten that feeling yet from 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 the first few rounds that we've seen so far. So I'm I'm still swinging both ways. I'm here. I'm still swinging both ways. I still think we're gonna see a good game here. I think it's gonna be close. Close round. Definitely win. But look at. He is by here. Bulldogs, it's a force. If they lose this round, it's gonna be five. And Solar going down at the start is not a good look for PA already. As the Sky Valley is coming in, as Vampire gets healed up. Back to 100 HP, at least 99, which is close. Running into his KJ site, so. Yeah, all the are looking rough for PA since they bought up into it as well, so they don't have money for next. Do you remember his thing? Hey, man. 50 kills on the gun of Fable. <laughs> <laughs> <They're> 50. <laughs> I mean, four members leaning on this A side, but Fable carrying out B link. Maybe. I'm trying to draw some rotates, but. No movement has been oh, made yet. Yeah, a Oh, clean kill coming out of Shiro. Giving hope for some KC, and maybe another one. Yes, he does fight it on the Fable. This Just game, though, is his. <laughs> As the so KJ Molly's come in, dealing the damage that left. needs to be done. As PA seems to be happy to play a retake with two kills done mid, so not scared to lurk as victory games. Maybe finding a timing and does on Tresente, evening up the numbers into a 3v3. And Rav bring the numbers into favor of KC, 3v2 now, and he has deep CT controls. This retake looks all out of sort from KC, uh, PA now. Yeah, this is gonna be a hard retake on the side of PA. Already, they're down a person. Look at Rap. Alls. No stars for the for Shiro. No flashes. Nothing. One oh, remaining. Snowy goes down, and Shiro's not long for this world as well. It's a taste like ends the round with two, and that's four in a round. It seems like it's gonna be a save for the fifth on PA side. That moment is gone, but it'd be cool. Old. And that's now we are here. timeout already. These early timeouts. I mean, a, a similar one on map three. A time, the timeouts for <clears throat> PA have been pretty great. Every time they're taking a timeout, they've managed to get they've managed to see at least two to four rounds off of the off of the timeout. Oh yeah, it's it's hundred percent. The timeout like post, but this one they they're on the eco, so they gotta work some sort of magic here at least. They have a stinger right now. They do have the viper's pit that that definitely could be used with. Knives in one and wall in one two for the Astra. Definitely have these tools to maybe win out this eco round, which is direly needed so far as it's looking like a similar site to Fracture. I don't know. I still feel this could go both ways. I'm optimistic. I'm awfully optimistic for some reason. Awfully optimistic for the PA side. Let's see if this optimism is uh, put in the right place at least. <laughs> As we're coming out of this timeout, straight into, I just said the eco on PA side, which it doesn't put optimism, at least for me. But let's see what magic they can do. Chet Knives is definitely a win condition here. Solo definitely has that one orb. Yeah, and definitely well, on the other side, Seekers, Astral Wall ready too. It's definitely a rough round to win as. Solar, so aggressive, running out already, not connecting, but Snowy's bullet does. Okay, out, Raz, Rav, and Satastic goes down as well. This B-Link fight not going into favor of KC as they get two guns. But, Vampire here, and 320, both getting guns of his own. And Shiro, oh, in a worse position possible. Getting crunched on both sides, and so much for Sautaku to do, and not much for her to do it with. Just this frenzy, ready. Box and screen down. And the Viper. Yeah, you can pick up a gun, right? Able to pick up the gun now, but... Has three KC members Toxins to go through before able to win this round. And the first one is 320, but she will win out. It's now just a 2v1. Both players playing on opposite sides of Does the site. Does have the pit. Can use it to get the round here. What she expect, Fable in this deep secret position? 
the turret spots are coming out. The troll blades are coming out, about to come out here. What? It's blocking oh, it backwards. Oh, oh. There's a trail blazer. The stun coming out, the swing, and nothing Saltaco could do as she gets taken out by Fable. And that's five on the board for KC. That was a safe round. And here okay, comes I the buy. I looked at Empire's gun. It says 20 kills. Uh, <laughs> spectator book? <laughs> or is he that just. Or is he just that goaded? Oh my god, I looked at him like 20 kills in 5 rounds? No way, right? <laughs> I mean, I feel like he deserves 20 kills after like holding down that round for his team. Two of them were going down early, B Link giving up guns, and Vampire is somehow like was able to clutch that back, so. For <laughs> Aggo coming out of Solar, so much B aggression, or mid aggression, I should say. And Vampire just chilling powerless. in this window area. You are divided! As the rest of his team barrels down B long. Yeah, I mean, B, B side simulator, right? You don't, oh, man, Solar, solar. find the timing. Oh, did, I think he's, did, he, did he see a gun? He, he does, but. Oh. Old man reactions, maybe. Mempire. Finding the first one. Shiro gets a good trade. Oh, Continues on to flank, and Chasente cleaning one of his own and backside, so. Where are those red? Oh, just spot the head. Just the head is two, and Shiro overwhelmed, so it's all up to. Snowy and Chasente is taking that bomb, maybe. Ill advised. All of the story now is 1v2. We ring around the Rosie the Pillar, getting toyed with right now by 320 games. Not able to find anything. And time is oh ticking, so. <laughs> this, has, this is bullying, right? This has to be bullying, right? <laughs> oh, the, 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 maybe trying a bit too much playing. I mean, a bit too much fun, but time is ticking down. Four stories, so she got to speed up, and nothing can be found. 320 games puts it out. Six on around four KC, and. This map is slowly falling out of the grasp of PA. I don't know what you, I don't know what you were what you said about PA cooking pearl, but they are not cooking pearl. They are I not. Mean, I agree. They are not cooking pearl. You know, weird. I was trying to hype out the PA pearl, but I was in that scrim, and let me tell you, it did not go well for KC. But oh, was it KC or it or PA? KC or KC is the not KC, but for uh, PA. Oh, we're, oh. Okay, but, so they did lose the scrim. <laughs> yeah, yeah, they did lose the scrim. But they did win this map. And they did do a similar comeback against TT in the semifinals. They were down quite a few rounds. So I believe it was like 9-3 or something bad like that. And they won in the end. So they definitely had the resilience on this map, at least. That's, so it's nice to stick it down, but it's left with this deagle here. Something to find value with, but... Not much could be found so far. It's more B aggression. Rav, loving to take these early fights for the team. And I'm 3 totally games is actually the one that finds the first. And Sal Taco with his frenzy once again in her smoke. Try to find something, but maybe not as Rav is behind her. And maybe she can't find nothing at all, but maybe it's Rav that's the one that's getting caught out. Yeah, it's taking out Snowy, but. Sal, Sal Taco and Shiro both finding too, so definitely some chance in this round Not for BA. Both the killers do have their own lockdown. A reclear from 320. Just barely missing, and Sal Taco oh, finding a clutch kill in his area, but this yeah. game, look at 320. This is oh, the wall comes up at the worst time possible. It does break the defender. Maybe not. He's whipping on. A bad kill, kill train knockdown, but it's fine. The attackers do have their lockdown. Oh, down. a bit early on the swing, but uh oh, Jairo is detained. It's Let quite open for him. It's all up to Taco, and she can't do anything as well. So that's seven on the board for KC. I mean, what you're talking about that there was the attacker lockdown set up. Maybe he, he seems lost in the sauce. Maybe he was hoping that somebody would break it for him. I'm not sure, but. There's not much that can be done. It's 7 for KC, and you were talking about how you weren't confident in KC earlier. Are you in confident in them now? I am confident, yes, but um, I'm not 100% there. I'm like 95. You're still 90? 95. You're still 95. 95 right now? Yeah, I'm, I'm, not, I'm not there yet. I'm okay, not on the okay. KC train yet. Not, oh, not on the train. 
Seven all lead, and you're still a hater. I'm not a hater. I'm just, I'm just, I haven't made the decision yet. Don't get in my way. That is what. A nice. Spike. Pit coming out of Salt Taco here. Left Solar pushing up all at the A main. She knows that these KC players have to be on this B side. And South Taco finding such an insane timing. Uh oh oh. But maybe if I'm getting timing himself, statistic oh, no. back to back with Solar. Oh. Not looking at each other, so they each come on with their day. As all the action is P long. And maybe B Ling, as I say, as Mempire wins out the Kenji 1v1 and out the side a tiny bit more and Oh, oh no, the, the, the seeker. seeker. But he does find value and drops that dash is in. It dashes to his death as Solar with three in the splank Five position. And then Fable stuck screens, back holes by left. himself, but though he's unaware, yeah, so he gets a free kill at Sal Taco. Needs to hold down this B side, has spike in his in her view. And Shiro, not aware Fable is actually the CP's position. Either oh. is Solar. So Sal Taco's pit is the Poison's last off. bit of respite. Four APA left. and eight seconds in, Four does find a first kill. He still lived, but Fable finds a spam through the smoke, and that's eight rounds for KC. Out of all the rounds we've seen so far, that was the closest PA has gotten to securing a round. <laughs> I mean, that's close, but they need more than close when they're down eight rounds right now. They need numbers on the board right now. Like, 8 0 start? It's looking so tragic for them. I want. Maybe an, at least a, maybe another timeout. I don't know what can they change to bring back this half at least a bit. I honestly cannot tell you. I mean, they've been running B splits. They've been running A splits. They've just been they're just losing all their gunfights. Feels like they're getting flanked. Maybe Casey's just warming up now, but knife does tag too. Uh, does have some info as Casey. Oh. Barely down P Long again, as you said. The P Long simulator with the KO ult. The knife coming out of Molly as well. And Solar oh, finding a first punt for once. And PA's kills. So Jacente finding another one on the ult and KO. So. This KC exec is. halted in his tracks. But look at Vampire gets past the KJ bot oh. because of it down. But. Oh, but Sal the Taco judge can aware. win. The Sal judge. Taco so aware that. He could be in this position and finding Mempire. It's the judge. Easily. Knowing that these plays are here. Fable putting some doubt in the mind of PA, but One there's no remaining. doubt in Shiro as he gets a clean kill mid. So it's all up to Saintistic by himself. 1v5 and oh talk of the judge running him down. A so, flawless to finally put a round on the board for PA. What a Needed round for PA and a flawless at that. I mean, that's a clean round, but that's kind of what we need to see like four rounds ago. And instant timeout coming out of KC. First round they've lost. They're like, guys, first round they're lost. We need timeout right guys, now. Guys, what happened? We got flawless. Right we need a timeout here. We, we can break their momentum before it even takes out. <laughs> takes out. No, I already right saw there's, there's no momentum built right now already. <laughs> it's before just they put the momentum run, we gotta stop it right now. Well, now they do have guns. The round they won was without talking to the judge, which did find so much. Two on the round. And now, it looks like they're cooking up by the pings. It looks like the quick up something mid. Uh, we might see like an all out brawl there with Solar dashing through B Link once again. B Link shops. It seems like there's going to be. Yeah, they're going to pressure mid a lot from the defense side. Probably definitely, use some snake bites to cover off the other angles. So that... Yeah, definitely on the lookout for that. But KC does still have a comfortable lead. There. I don't. I doubt they're sweating much. They're just taking that time out saying, guys, that's just one round. Let's calm down a bit. Mm -hmm. Let's see what went wrong with round and let's make sure not to repeat that. So cool. Yep. And man, look at this. Four players, five players yeah. pretty much mid yeah. for PA, but four players all a main for KC. So, oh, oh what a poly just... lineup. And Zolar trying to find fight somewhere as he gets all blinded. 
getting pushed back it back to the doors, but Repeaking wants the space back game, again. Game and another one, flash, but... another flash out. And this time finding Valley, Rap finding some 320 as well. So that's two kills going away of KC as Snowy tries to answer back a tiny bit, but Saint Tistix says no to secure the lead. 4 2. All up to just sent in is Shiro. I've got your Play off these mid as the secrets come out. Nothing much can be done. And Saint Tistix wins another one. Shiro left behind his lonesome, so. Need some heroics from the smokes player for PA to get a second on the board. They know his location. Bucket turret, the stun, the suck, everything's thrown at him. <laughs> the, the stun again. I mean, they know his location, so might as well bully him, right? Oh, 100%, but he knows he's behind this box and spam just isn't connecting, which is unfortunate for him, but. In the head I just imagine after that, why you bully me? Why you bully me, man? <laughs> why you bully me? <laughs> why you bully me? But it's not, I don't think it's just the Astro. All of PA right now is getting bullied by KC. 9 1 so far, 8 round lead. This mid aggression, not finding much. 320 games, just so nice of it. Two pop flashes out of windows, shutting down Solar. Yeah, for some reason, not dodged, not looked away. Probably hoping for the trade coming in, but... Hoping for the no trade, trade coming in, but... Here. The trade was coming in from KC side with Rav holding the shop single. Mm -hmm. More <laughs> aggression. Maybe not learning the lesson. No one but... Yeah, still not going away with Solar. Cool. And Stoey as well, three turn of games. These two, a dynamic duo, winning every fight mid. And more first bloods going away of KC, so the number 3v5. Here. Rough for PA looking here as Tracente is getting crunched on A site. And that's entry. And so that's, that's entry, level. that's. That's the say, you got three kills already. Oh, but maybe he's not talking about finding one at least. He's averaging a bit, 2v4, it's definitely a winnable position if she can find another one statistic, but. No, oh, oh, Fable. Fable. Just missed the timing, but getting it back again as Sautaco and Ice Mountain not ready for the sky to be pushed up mid as once again, so 1v4 for Shiro, maybe Blocking that vision. needs to bring back the why you bully me for impression here because there's not much Shiro could do with two mollies on bomb is suck and so much detail left for KC. Well, they just don't even gonna fight her. I'm not gonna fight, just trying to get the gun. Look at Rav, ready for Ari to say, come, I'm 33, I don't care, come at me, but he might just not spike here, yeah he does, two guns down, consolation prize, but it's so rich, so it doesn't matter at the money. end. They have so much money, they are so rich. They have so much, it doesn't matter, it's the last round and... PA so broke. I mean... I mean, K KC here is looking like Bill Gates, while PA is your average college student with the Stinger, the Digo, the Spectre trying to bust up what they can, but the wallets of KC are so huge having the rifles and the knives and lockdown in one, so. They're running the typical A push that any team would do with the Sky Flash coming in. There's the lockdown that goes down. There's a huge card. There's a Suck Star coming in as well. Yep. Shiro does have to walk for post band, so playing A main isn't as successful as could be as the wall is coming in, which is pushing Casey back into their own spawn and Gron rotates out of South Taco and Tricente as well. So looks like a reset around 40 seconds down, two ults down. Definitely. Oh, I if I were Casey here, I would re hit. I would re hit A. Wait for the asshole to go down and just re hit it. Oh, 100 percent. Now they could re hit. Now it's re stacking for the speed link with Ram That's running down gets taken down by Chasenti's Digo one tapping in the head and Solo with the Guardian trying to do the same because these three players long. But maybe it's South Taco Funny Valley even or not. Not getting oh, no. through. But Chasenti, Chasenti is the one who finds me with the Vandal. And just these two players long by themselves, that's nothing can be found, but maybe Mempire can be finding nothing. 
Finding something out of nothing as it's all up to Snowy and Shiro. 12 seconds left. It is found by the knife. It's planted in safe. Knows position. And trying to take it to one and oh, easily cleaned up by Snowy. A 10 2 half. To pull two half. Switching sides. Definitely looking rough on the side of PA, but. It's not over yet. I won't say it's over yet. Let's go. What do you think Casey did so good BYB that that let them get such a humongous lead over PA like... there? I feel like I'm not a fan of their PA's mid pushes because on a map like Pearl, the peaks on the attacker side are so much better because shops can support the mid peak and the window peak can support the shops peak. While on the defense side. There's that big barrier in the middle of mid that just stops the two sides from this helping from each other. So I'm not a big fan of their mid pushes. But here, we're seeing a mid push coming from Casey themselves. Careful. Though, contact one, not rushing. Or PA themselves, I should say. Loving this mid area. Contacting all the way up to art. As Raf finds pushed up, gets yeah, Taltaco yeah. the lurker, and 320 games, clean flash, finds one, but gets traded out by Shiro. Maybe all of PA kind of trapped into our position, is not looking good for them. Raf pushing out of mid. Push up behind them, so only Memphire had a sheriff. All of PA, Dog A main, and Memphire doesn't enemy matter enemy. if he has a sheriff now because he finds the kill anyways. Atistic gets one as well, so that's 11 on the board for KC. And man, I feel like it's over for PA here. They needed that round. Oh, no, they definitely no, did. Now they have to thrifty <laughs> the next round to even have a chance of breathing. I mean, at this point, I think he's just forced, no? You have to, yeah. They need to win this round, but look at the buys. It's two Bulldogs, a Judge, and three Bulldogs like that, so... It's so hard to find value oh, with no. these shorter range guns when the Bulldogs are keep you such I'm a far distance away. I'm like, this is where you see Casey go with the, with a the rifle as a Phantom or a Vandal, but this time they don't have the economy for that. They don't need it. They don't need it as well. <laughs> They're such a comfortable lead. Why take any risks when they could give over the Phantom to the other side? But more A main aggression from PA here. There's a wiper wall that you were looking for. That's the value of the wiper wall, but I'm not sure how much it will find here as G20 games is pushing through above it. As trying to dash up, but the Molly's aren't prepared for it. But the shots are connecting for Solar and South Taco. They find two on the entry. It's a 4v3 in the favor of PA. And Damn, so scary scammed. for Shiro. As Fable oh, played the secret point. position and down A. You getting so much value and a wall oh. bang on top of that. Does like five damage. <laughs> five damage wall bang, what does it matter? Remaining. But maybe it does, it's PA, it's finding the kills they needed and Saintistic. Spike down. Those the planter is maybe some life for KC in this Make round it. specifically, but pulling them in! These two PA players are enough HP in there. Definitely a round winnable for PA here. Crucial round to win. Much needed round winnable for PA, and they the do close it out. The run and gun, run and gun from South <laughs> Taco is the thing. Closes it out, and. That is a bit of life. This is the Fnatic Loud scoreline for PA. I mean, KC is pushed down to two shorties. Lovely, Fnatic did it. Do you think uh, PA can do it? <laughs> Fnatic did it. Five Bulldogs on the side of KC here. But man, this game, I hope they can do it. I want to see a banger here. But this is the stack on I'll the side definitely of... Breathe, definitely the one. Breathing life into this PA comp. Oh, 100%. But this is shorty finds no value, but Rav has another one back sight. 
And that one does find the value needed, taking out Satako and living as well, which is such a surprise. But not for long, as Solar Siro both getting Wolfen kills. I mean, just look at Brock Sixteen for Solar and then the next one is just eight at eight. Yeah, Satako. A breath of fresh air needed for this PA squad. And possibly four in a round. Here at least, most likely, definitely. I don't think Mempire can do here, just a classic getting knife now. <laughs> the thumbs up spray just tells it all. Yes, just trying to run out and nothing can be done, so. Corner run for PA. It is the start, but now they gotta deal with the rifles. Four Bulldogs against five rifles. Definitely a round should be favored inside of KC. Better weaponry, but. Anything could be happening here. I don't know, they've been hitting their shots with the Bulldog, so... Maybe keep with it. <laughs> yeah, maybe keep with it. And again, the beat serial litter is what's working for them. So Taco and Shara both have to... Impressive. Hit and wall respectively in one old point. Well... Ooh, Rob finding a... Nice first kill, but some damage traded back and that's it! The sky heal! <sighs> Coming in clutch, healing up. Damage though, and what a bad start for PA. And uh, Zay just that. makes it even worse. So, these three players, two mid right now. Sal Taco, the character oh. looking at as Sh oh, Shiro. <laughs> Punishing Raw of aggression and. Walking into the A side. Patriot is housed and it is committed as well, so. Commitment on Vampire on the edge of that. Almost finding timing on Satako. But it's not in the end and. Uh, game right, right, so he's and he's getting ran A and to try to stop the plan, but at the end it doesn't matter. As he walked in. That's fine, it doesn't fit down. They will find the clutch kill needed and say Tastic follows remaining. up with another one. It's all up to Shiro. Flash beat Bully in this corner and nothing he can do, so that's match and series point for KC. And championship point. Match, championship, series point. It's all in the hands of KC now. 4-12. Deficit for P8. Eight rounds in a row needed to close this one back, but... It's doable, it's doable. Just played round by round. Round by round, round by round. Solar pulling out the op this round. <laughs> Haven't seen that on this map either half yet. As despite I mean, they don't need it. <laughs> that is true, despite KC's dominant scoreline, their eco isn't in the greatest spot right now. Rough downgrades his light shield, but does have the knife, so a bit vision. of solace in that. So Ash can definitely be long. Double star is already posted up, so. Both teams willing to take this round slower, knowing how pivotal, how important this singular round is where if Casey wins, there will be. how deep Saltaco is. Champion. Saltaco is getting found out and not winning 1v1 in the end. The Lurk not finding any value. That's the rest of PA not with her, and that's their fragger. Oh, yeah, <laughs> that's weird to say about Viper, but yeah, that's their fragger. 16 kills compared to the 10 of Shiro, who's the next highest person now. Solar is pushed up his off. Does not know Sintisk position. No, uh, Rob and Sintisk both getting kills at the same time. That's PA yes. is falling apart, but Snowy's trying to stem the bleeding, which. I don't know how much they can stem. Oh, sure, against Memphis. Shiro well. finds another one, so maybe slight solace in this. Because there's a 2v3, 4 PA, but 320 games, making it look into a 3v1. As is off to Shiro, needs the clutch. 320 games does not connect the bullets. 27 HP, 10 seconds left. 10 seconds it's left. so hard for Shiro to do anything. His statistic is so close. Stop on anything as KC will Defender. be your master champion for BDC Season 4. Well done.
by both teams to to bring it to map three. Oh, map five, I mean. So map five, oh my god. I feel lightheaded after that series. Like, amazing gameplay from both teams. It was so back and forth, and... Man, I just, congratulations to both teams, but especially... KC, who is your VDC Season 4 Master Champion. Congratulations to them all. Again, you but, can see that. Salt Taco. Salt Taco. <laughs> the the shining light on that rough PA map on Pearl. Topping the charts despite quite a rough loss, 13-5. And basically all five members of KC right behind her, showing their amazing teamwork and how like evenly distributed their talent is. Yeah, what a series. I, I feel so lightheaded after casting that five-game banger. What a series. What's up with PA and KC just giving us bangers? Yeah, what a series that was. It was 3-2 in the favor of Kingdom Coffee and their espresso team. Huge yeah. congratulations to that team. Saintistic, 320 games, Rav, Mempire, and Fable. Saintistic was the sub, right? So mm -hmm. he Correct, gets a special exclusive role in... Uh, you know, it's a bit of a special uh, congratulation that uh, I think you get what it, because they were subbing in. They're not the full time player, but in the booth to for a special announcement, we've got X Nolan. Nolan, you have the floor. Hello, hello. Uh, filling in for Reggie today for the MVP announcement for the Master Tier. Uh, first, obviously. Got to thank the media team for the beautiful stream today. Five maps is not easy to sit through, especially when you're doing something. Uh, nuclear production, Maddie observing, ZMJ stabbed, beautiful casting. Love it. Um, but what we're all here for, the Master MVP. Uh, this is a pretty unanimous, unopposed decision um, among the stats team. Uh, there were other concerns considerations but one candidate went out above the rest uh by far the best player by rating out of the players that were eligible for mvp uh very solid consistency for somebody primarily playing duelist all around really high ranking stats uh compared to everyone else in the tier and the highest kpr the only player in the tier um with a kills per round over one your master mvp is chris Let's go, Chris Sanity! Ooh, that's my player! <laughs> that's one win for IE. Hey, 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 hey. Hey, at oh, man, least, at least players, my franchise had an elite team make playoffs compared to yours that doesn't even have an elite team. <laughs> I don't think it's the fault of the franchise, but... Yeah, yeah. As a Masters player myself, Chris is one of the hardest opponents to face. His aim is insane, and... Every time you peek, if he's there, man, you know you're getting sat down. So, really well deserved by him. Congratulations. Congratulations, Chris Sanity. I don't know if you're in chat. Let's go, Chris. Congrats. Uh, thanks, Nolan, for the hopping in the booth real quick for the announcement of your master here, MVP Ooh. for VDC Season 4. Um, I think that's all. So, I think that's all for us. Um, Saturday at 8.30, I think, or 8 o'clock, is your final 7.30 p.m. Eastern Time is your mass, uh, advanced tier grand finals between Omnipotent Sandwiches and Solaris. You do not want to miss it. It's going to be great. We will see y'all again then. And, but until then, have a wonderful night and have a wonderful rest of your week. From us in the media Bye. team. Bye. Have a good night. Yeah. Solaris. Yeah. Solaris. <laughs> <laughs>